Hello, my friends. We're back. We are back, back, back to Link's Awakening on the Switch. And it's Thursday. It is Thursday, my dudes. That's not how that meme goes, right? That's a, a hip meme for happening kids. Yeah? <laughs> oh, man. We're in for it tonight. How's everybody doing? Hi, Tuner. Hi, Daewoo. Uh, if I recall, we get... Well, I mean, I do recall. I can see right there. We have two instruments so far. We started last stream. And we were, on, we were looking for either golden leaves... Or golden feathers. We're looking for golden something that we're supposed to bomb suspicious places to find. And then we give them back to this guy. So that's what we're doing. In the meantime, I also need to gather 980 rupees so that I can get the bow and arrow from the shop. Because I want to steal from the shop so bad. Because that's such an absurd price. But my link is not having a life of crime. What happens if I hit this bee, do you think? Is it going to be like Animal Crossing style? Maybe I can bomb the bee? Nothing? Nothing happens if I hit the bee? Alright, well. Oh, that looks suspicious. I don't even see this before. So yeah, we're just going to hop right, right into things because... All I know is that we're supposed to be looking for... I think. Am I supposed to go down this hole? I don't- nope. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? What did I open? It made a noise like I solved a mystery. But I- I- I only found more mystery. Hmm. Oops, I didn't mean to drop a bomb there. Tuner, when are you supposed to get Ori's new, uh, fancy cage? It's very elaborate. I thought maybe I could do a cool flip. I can't do a cool flip. Okay, we'll just continue on. Oh god, that thing has bombs. Can I... Oh, can I do like a flip hit? Oh, I can. Look at that. Oh god, I'm getting wrecked. Oh yeah, I forgot. I kind of forgot about my shield, you guys. Oh no. You don't know, unfortunately. They're hand building it, so they told you you have a lot of orders right now, so it'll be a minute. That's really uh, fancy. Getting a ah, a hand built one. Okay, well, you know what? Let's just read this sign. Canalette Castle. The castle is where he said he came from, so I bet his things are there. I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh god. I should go up to that fairy that we actually had just found. That seems reasonable. And then we'll head to the castle. You see that sweet flip? Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at that. Good as new. Good as new. You can't even tell I, I uh, got hit by a bomb 8 million times. <laughs> This game is really so cute, and I love the menu music. Sometimes sometimes I leave the menu music unmuted for you guys, but sometimes I don't because it's a game that, like, will go back to... will, like, start playing a demo, you know what I mean? And this is one of those games that starts playing a demo. So I just sit with, the, with it muted while I s finalize a couple of things and enjoy the nice music for myself. Can I bomb... can I bomb these? Maybe. Oh god. Maybe I can... Nope! Nope. Not the way. They make them 100% safe for chinchillas. They also make custom cages for rabbits, ferrets, and prairie dogs. Prairie dogs, huh? I wonder how I get over there. Well, here's the castle, it looks like. Ah! Castle's riddled with spiders. <laughs> 50 paces. Let's see if we can go in. I don't think I can go in. Sad. Can I break in? Time to look for ways to break in. Juno has a pretty, uh, a, like a pretty tall cat tower, but I just got it off Amazon. Are you friendly? You are. Bananas! Bananas! 
Oh, yeah, we do have bananas. Here you go, Kiki. <laughs> ooh, ooh, Kiki, monkeys, come, repay him, Kiki. <laughs> Kiki! What do you have for us, monkeys? Are they building us a bridge? Well, good thing we happened to do all that trading earlier. <laughs> Monkey business. Done. Bye-bye. Ooh, Kiki. Bye-bye. Oh, handy little monkeys. And we found a stick a monkey left behind. I was wondering, I was like, that seemed like a short uh, trade quest. But clearly there's more. Um, I, I know that we should could go across the bridge, but I would like to explore what's over here. Leave me alone, pigs. What are their actual names? Oh, that's going right in the hole. I can't remember what those things are actually called. Oh, man. There we go. It's incredible how unsafe many things... Oh, how many unsafe things pet stores sell and market them for small animals. You've had to throw away a few toys and treats that you learned were unsafe. Yeah, cats and dogs are easier because it's pretty universal. Yes, thank you. Uh, is it Eli? Eli Naomi? Moblins. I knew they were not called pigs. And I knew they were not bokoblins from Breath of the Wild or whatever. Seashell Mansion. We have some seashells. What do you do with them? I wager we might finally find out. I am the spirit of the mansion. I have been waiting for someone. Who, one who can overcome the darkness. Find the secret shells, then ascend the platform. You will receive the ultimate sword. Huh. Sounds like you should come back with lots of sit shells and try standing on the platform. I just want to see. I mean, we're not doing the best, but we're not doing... Oh! I thought this would just be a check. I didn't realize I'd get a prize. So I'm assuming it's a prize for each level of the seashell. Like, there's the little seashell breakers, or breakup lines. I bet that's probably the the distinction. Hi, Milf. How you doing? We got a piece of heart. I think that puts us at two. Oh, three. So that's fun. Now we know what the, the seashell... Oh, God. The seashells are for. Leave me alone. There, uh, there we go. Oh, there's one right here. <laughs> oh, why is that glowing? Am I supposed to bomb it or dig it? Let's find out. Or maybe neither. Okay, not bomb. Ooh, there's some strange energy coming from here. You should take a closer look. Don't mind if I do. What does that mean? Oh, okay, so that's what those waypoints were. Because we found this waypoint earlier, but we couldn't really do anything with it. So that's good to know. Oh, you're eating dinner right now? KFC? You get extra crispy? Extra crispy, you're bust. Sup, Dingpot? I ruined your not getting banned in the 2020s decade. I didn't ban you, I timed you out for only one second and it was just to delete your message. I know there's a more efficient way to delete messages, but I I am lucky enough to where I, I, I can't swim. Um, I have to do it so infrequently that I have never really had to uh, mess with it. Yes, extra crispy is the best, Melf. Well, that was an easily discovered secret. It's not the same thing. Time out in a band is not the same thing. Uh, uh, uh. Oh god. Whoa. We're on our way. We're busting into the castle. Oh, we made it. Well, that was... That went better than expected. Can I even hit this guy? He has intense armor. Oh, yep. That was that was much easier than expected. Oh, I gotta wait until he staggers. Can I lift this? Oh, yeah, I can. 
Time to break stuff. I forgot about the fact that I could break stuff. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. You saw a headline that says Xbox has a new adapter that allows people to use their wheelchairs as controllers. That's pretty cool. Xbox has been pushing the adaptive controller pretty heavily. No more coffee jokes for you. It wasn't the coffee. It was, it was the, you know what it was. You know. Especially uh, right after a raid from a very wholesome community. <laughs> uh. Would you kiss your mother with that mouth? Sup, Tuzzle? Oh! I want this thing. I want to get it. Where are you going? Oh, this would be nice to have the the bow and arrow. Maybe I can just hop. Ooh. All right. So how many of these are we supposed to get? A gold of golden leaves. I think it's five. Five. <laughs> five. <laughs> we need the five golden leaves, my friends. Can we do it? Can we get the five golden leaves? Uh, <laughs> let's see if I can light these. This feels like another challenge. No? Nope. Okay. No respect. Yeah, you're sleepy. I mean, it's it's a reasonable bedtime for you right now, I feel. I feel like it's a reasonable time to sleep. Sup, Omelet King? How you doing? What am I doing? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm just... Extra crispy is the best way to go. Also, their macaroni and cheese is bomb. I don't normally get their macaroni and cheese at KFC just because... Well, I mean, I don't really go to KFC very often any nowadays, but when I do go, I get mashed potatoes. Even though I don't like gravy, their mashed potatoes are still really good. Although Popeye's has better mashed potatoes, if you ask me. Let's go inside the castle. You never even saw those when you played this game? The, le the leaves? I thought it was... I, I was under the assumption I was doing a mandatory quest. All right, enjoy your your couch lying. Ooh. Oh, the things to light, yeah, or not light. <laughs> I thought they were. I thought they were gonna be mandatory. They were not. Oh, there's another one. <laughs> thank you, thank you, uh, Naomi. <laughs> I try. I'm not very good at accents. I can only really do uh, one non-distinct. Oof. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh god. Ah! Also, no more watching Game Grumps. The music is good. Why can't you watch Game Grumps anymore, Dingplot? I don't really know much about Game Grumps. I think the only thing that I know about Game Grumps is they have that that one where they're reading the they're playing some like oh god I didn't think that was going to come up the stairs uh, like a Nancy Drew game or something like that and it's like I shot and I missed and then I shot and then I missed I think that's them are you not going to hit me come at me bro You get a 12-piece bucket, so you get three sides? That's supposed to be that face. <laughs> hey, I thought maybe you were just loving the world, you know? Also, 12-piece bucket is a good size for your for your family. But if I were getting a 12-piece bucket, I would just get three sides of uh, mashed potatoes. You're joking because that's where you heard the joke from. Ah. Uh... Well, I don't want you to feel bad that you made the joke or anything. Because I understand. I get it. But, I'll, uh, I mean, if you if we want to get too in-depth <laughs> about why I deleted the joke, is that a, a lot of people have a lot of feelings about gender. And that particular joke might not align with a lot of things people think and feel. And I would not want to upset anybody. If we want to get vague. 
You have pizza? Pizza sounds really good. I had pizza the other day. I couldn't resist. I'm not... I'm like... I'm supposed to be eating better, but I... This week, I could have... I basically have been, like, binge eating this week. I was doing really well, like, all of January, and then I... This week, at the beginning of the week, I just kind of didn't feel great. And then I went ham. I went nuts. Boop. You gave Ori some crushed rose... Rose chip? What is that? Rose hips? And when she chewed them, it sounded like she had pop rocks in her mouth. They were so crunchy. You ate three hot dogs? I... You know what I always feel like doing? I don't know how to... Oh, this is probably the dust. Um, at Costco? I love their hot dogs so much. Okay, maybe it's not the dust. I... Oh, I was supposed to throw a pot at it. Duh. <laughs> it's a picture of a pot. Um... I always feel like I love Costco hot dogs so much that I want many of them. <laughs> and then I'll order two and then I'm like, I did not want two Costco hot dogs. Jesus. What did I have today? Oh, I had Raising Cane's, which is a chicken finger place that is not regional, but it's in, like, really weird spread out locations. Oh my god. This thing's wrecking me. Rose hips? You're not exactly sure what they are, but they're good treats for chinchillas. Huh. I thought I was reading it wrong. I don't know what that is at all. You had pizza today, damn Portnoy? What does that mean? Is that a place? A pizza place? Okay, we missed one. I missed one somewhere. We gotta find. You're in West Virginia? Mount Mama, take me home. Do you hear that a lot? <laughs> I have never been to West Virginia. Usually if I've ever been out like east, like southeast-ish, it's usually Kentucky. I've been to Kentucky many times. Okay, what did we miss? I'm assuming it's got to be out here somewhere. Let's fight all these guys. We'll see if we find anything. That looks suspicious. I got something for fighting the whack-a-mole. One vote, everyone knows- oh, one bite, everyone knows the rules. What's that a slogan for? That's familiar. The only thing that I think is suspicious is this bird. Maybe if I throw a boulder at the bird? Can I throw a boulder at the bird? I can! Yes! Okay! Let's go turn these, uh, these leaves in, baby! Portnoy is the barstool guy. He does the pizza reviews. Oh, one bite. You know the rules. Now I have put two and two together. I have I have no plans to be out to West Virginia anytime, anytime soon. Uh, humidity is not for me. Also, you've been hanging out with a if you can't beat them, join them stream a lot lately. Is that a... What is that? Is that a game? I don't know what that... <laughs> I'm old, Captain Dingbot. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> I want these apples. I feel like I should be able to get the apples. I love this little shuffle. Look at him. Look at him shuffling. Everyday link shuffling. I only know the one bite everyone knows the rule thing from my friend Jim. Because he uh, somehow got sucked into the the Barstool Sports pizza guy. Woo! I do not like those spider things. That's unpleasant. Okay, if I recall, we just need to go back the hall oh, the way we came. What? Also, is that a flying banjo emote, Dingput? Oh my god. Oh, I didn't realize I could hit these. 
probably could have saved myself a lot of grief. Okay, I don't- maybe I don't exactly remember where we're going. Oh, I'm in the right ballpark. We just have to swing around. I wonder if he's gonna give us the key for this. I thought he was over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Maybe I don't remember where this guy is. Oh, you can zoom in on the map, though. That's nice. That's not there. He was angry that we had brought the chump, the chain chump with us. Um... Hmm. I don't really remember where you were, sir. Oh, down here! Duh! Uh, duh! Probably gonna save myself a lot of grief, she says, banning Dusty from Minecraft. Hey, Dusty. I gave you... I gave you beats. Alright? I gave you beats. And now you got the beats. You got the beats. I'll be here all week, folks. Ah, très bien. I see you've recovered all of the leaves. Now, move this statue and you will find your reward. This seems like a trap. Oh. I am forever in your debt for getting my leaves back. You're just kind of describing the type of streams you've been hanging out with. Oh, okay. It's a dead banjo emote. <laughs> oh god! I thought for I thought that was gonna fill a fill the gap. More seashells. I'm gonna switch to the shovel just because I don't want to accidentally use any of my wasteable stuff. My, why did this guy just why does this guy just have a secret entrance into a dungeon in his home <laughs> oh that is not a regular is that a, a skulltala I can't lift it maybe I can only bomb it let's try it hey No? Okay, whatever. He's into some freaky shit, the dead banjo? Or the or the um the prince. Why are there potholes? <laughs> Why? Okay, we have ourselves a maze of sorts. I understand. I understand the objective. <laughs> I know this is not the way to go, but I like I would like to clear out everything just in case. You recently got your kids to start Majora's Mask since they played most of the other Zelda games? That's fun. We were just talking last stream about how Majora's Mask is pretty divisive. It feels like people either love or really hate Majora's Mask. I thought I just saw something I could lift, but oh, it was probably one of the plants. You're saying they're a little bit more allowing of what you can say in their stream. I mean, if it really, I'm sorry if it really bothered you, Dean Clyde. It's really not a big deal. It was just a, it was just a quick timeout to delete a message because I know for a fact that there are people who regular this stream that I would like to include, and I would not like to off-put them by things in chat. In soil sleep secrets beneath your souls. So, well that was, this was not a very good reward. <laughs> you think the only one you guys don't have now is Wind Waker? You guys have a Wii U, Melf? Is 
Because if you have a Wii U, you can get the, uh... The remastered version. I feel like I had to have missed something. There's no way this was the gift. Unless it's just supposed to be that I'm supposed to get that... That heart piece that I'm missing. This town does have a serious hole problem. <laughs> Very true. The only thing we don't we don't allow here wasps. No wasps allowed. Qua. Ah! These flowers grow back very fast. Or I guess they're not flowers, they're leaves. Let's see what this owl has to say one more time. In soil sleep secrets beneath your souls. So that indicates that something... Up. Oh. I was like, something underneath. You got the slime key. Now you can open the gate in the Yukuku Prairie. Let's go. Wasps do suck. Almost everyone in the whole world agrees. Wow, look at us go. Gotta go fast. Alright. We've opened the gate. Or have we? We have. I guess we're getting straight into a dungeon today. Maybe. Can we figure out how to... Now it's going to be a matter of how to get in there. We'll figure it out, though. I love the little pushy noises. You like this dungeon? Sup, Geo? How you doing? Oh. Let's look at the map. It's kind of nice to have a game where I can look at the map and not get attacked. Looking at you, Hollow Knight. <laughs> I'm pressing... Oh, I was already zoomed in all the way I could be. Okay. It looks like... This would be the way... All the way over and across? That's what it looks like. Let's try it. Got a lurk playing Tarkov? Good luck. Don't die. I gotta try out Tarkov, you guys. I keep watching it, and but I, I just can't start something like that now. Oh, Link! I see you have a nice stick. Can I borrow it for a second? Yeah, sure. Is he gonna bug the bees? Don't do that. <laughs> I think you kind of asked for this. Hey, can I borrow your stick and uh? Poke a bee's nest? I, all right, the stick became the honeycomb. You're not sure how it happened, but take it. I will. Don't mind if I do, game. <laughs> yeah, Mario is also team fuck wasps. Although those were regular bees. Maybe we shouldn't uh, put propaganda in Mario's mouth. Also, his name is Taryn, I think. Or is Taryn the girl? And he's Marin. One of those two. One or the other. You're not used to your new glasses and you hit your head on the cabinet door? I really need to get new glasses. I need to make an appointment. But I just hate, I hate carving out time to go to the doctors for, for non, like, urgent things. Like, I'm, my insides are bleeding. <laughs> Level 3 key cavern. Oh boy, let me take a sip of water before we get in bark here. All right, it's time. Oh, bombs. Can these move? Okay. I love the dungeons. When I was little, I used to kind of dread the dungeons because I was little <laughs> and dumb. But now that I'm a grown adult with a big brain... <laughs> I'm excited to try them out. Okay. 
I don't know what the, how these bombs work. Oh my god, like that. Okay. That's why you're like a year overdue for, for an appointment. I am probably like two years. <laughs> because up until just this year, my uh, eye insurance would only pay for glasses every two years. And so I would just only go every two years. But now... Now that I I can get some what is this? What a weird object. There must be somewhere to t some way to tackle this object. We've run into those before and I don't remember what they did. Oh god. All right, I actually I, they didn't do anything cuz we didn't have a solution for them. We just left them be. We'll get back to them. I feel like I ate a lot of my words in my last sentence about going to the eye doctor. <laughs> It'll be 39 and May 3rd. Hey! That was rude. <laughs> there was a monster in that chest. Uh, That's fun. Are you gonna do anything fun for it? This... Um... What is this? What are you coming out of the woodwork for? Can I just jump over it? No. We'll circle back. Cupcakes? That's fun. I like, uh... I prefer cupcakes to... Like a birthday cake, usually. You love this game has a zoom in and out feature and that you can mark things on a map. Yes, there are lots of games that could benefit from that. Pokemon definitely being one of them. I never finished Diamond and Pearl. I actually, it's been a really long time. I always get every Pokemon game, but I, it's been a really long time since I finished one. I really want to fight this. Th oh, I have an idea. This is Binding of Isaac Strats. Oh, it worked a little bit. It worked a little bit. If I put a bomb there, though, it's gonna explode. Oh, man. Oh, we did it. But it didn't do anything. Oh, well. <laughs> you didn't listen to my advice, Geo? You died instantly? How are you liking Tarkov? How long have you been playing it? I saw that you were in range chat the other day asking about it. I haven't played it myself yet. It seems like I could get a scary level of addicted to it. What? Alright. This is a pretty... This dungeon has a pretty big map so far. Oh god. I don't know if the way that I'm doing this is the way that you're supposed to do it, but I'm gonna- it worked. It worked, so I'm gonna stick with it. If it's dumb but it works, it's not dumb. You played it a year or so ago and it's improved since then, since it's still grindy as heck. That's the thing that worries me about it, is it does seem very grindy. Aw, Key, why'd you have to go up there? Rude. We'll get it. We'll get it. Well, I'm assuming it's a key. Oh my god. Is- we're, I mean, we're gonna find out here in just a second. If the- The owl beak that we've picked up in the last dungeon, is it the same? Moving forward. It is- Nope. Okay. We need a different beak for each dungeon, it seems. I never found it in the first dungeon. Come to think of it, in the first dungeon there's a room we didn't investigate because I didn't have bombs. Because I thought I had to find them. But as it turns out, you just buy them at the shop. Oh, man. 
I really want the map. This dungeon's huge. An 80s kid. Go to a lot of discotheques in your day. I'm assuming that was just a shortcut we've unlocked now. Let's go this way. Well, that was not the choice to make. That was not a good choice. Did we go this way yet? We did not. You just finished Pokemon Leaf Green last month for the first time. It all comes full circle because the first Pokemon it was the first Pokemon game you owned. You got your original copy used from a GameStop back in 08. Oh you lost it and bought a new copy. So I've never played Leaf Green or Fire Red because I never had a Game Boy Advance. My first Pokemon was blue. Oops, that was the wrong direction. Can you go this way? There you go. Um, and then yellow. That was not right. Oh god. I'm messing up. Get in there! Why won't you get in there? Oh, okay. Eat that. <laughs> Why? Alright, see you later. Thanks for hanging out. Come on, come on. Oh god, give me that. I probably should have waited until we were done. Whew, I should go catch that jar. There's a jar in the fish in the fishing pond. <gasps> Better boots, you get Pegasus boots. If you hold left, you can dash. Try going for a long jump. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> oh my god! Look at how cute that is. Did I not update my category? <gasps> Why didn't anybody tell me I didn't update my category? No! Thank you, Stex. We are not playing retro. Thank you. It is fixed. It has been fixed. Alright, let's get out of here. Look at how cute it is. Can I... Oh! That's how we pop those things. Okay, we can't do that. You thought I raged again? Listen, there's no lies here. There's no rage here. Unless we're talking, uh, what's that one game? The one game. Shovel Knight. Unless it's Shovel Knight, there's no rage here. <laughs> no lies, only Zelda. Okay, so now we can go back up to... Let's go to the little teleporty thingy. And we'll go back to the main room. And we can pop those thingies. Pop the thingies. Yes, only Zool. Oh, man. Yours was either blue or leaf green. You remember getting blue with your first DS. But you can't remember... Um... Well, blue would have been, blue is an original Game Boy game, so I don't know that you because I know the original DS had the Game Boy Advance adapter. So unless you had a regular Game Boy, it was probably Leaf Green. Let's see. Pop, pop, pop! Look at him go. Can I just blast your enemies? I can. I wanted that heart though. Oh, I can still get it. Crisis averted. This was not helpful. I 
Should I come the other way? But you know what? Let's just go back to the main room and then we'll go to the right instead of up or to the left. Plenty of directions to try, my friends. Maybe. Okay, so somewhere there has to be a switch for us to find. The dash is so cute. The little pitter-patter. A guardian acorn. You got blue for like $8 back then because you had a Game Boy Advance. Now the game goes for like $30. There's so many games like that that it's like... Like I have Soul Silver from when it was new because I... That's my favorite generation of Pokemon. And to see how much you can sell that stuff for now is insane. You don't even have to try to be a collector these days. You just buy a game that you want and then in, th in three years it's triple the price. Got a piece of power. I've got the power. I really want that beak. This is an arrow. Look at that. That's an arrow. Can we bomb something? Look at us go. Oh, okay. So we just made a little shortcut. So I think I should be able to long jump over this then. Oh, that feels risky. Your favorite was Crystal? I never had Crystal. I just played Crystal for the first time like two years ago. I already got the Nightmare Key. Uh, I played Crystal on the 3DS when it came out, like in the eShop. And it was pretty fun. I liked it. I also got my first case of the Pokerus uh, in that version. Oh my god. I didn't even know that the Poker Rust was a thing until I, po I played it like two years ago. Because I'm not- I like to play Pokemon games very casually. I don't pay attention to Eevees, Ivies. I don't go to collect my- or I don't go to complete the Pokedex, anything like that. So I was living my whole life without knowing that the virus was a thing. It was pretty cool though. I had to look it up once I saw that. Yeah, crystal meth. First time I did crystal meth was uh, when I was playing my 3DS. <laughs> I sent some weird picta chats along with it. Plenty of street passes though. You don't know any Pokemon past Gen 2? <laughs> we call it clear in this chat. <laughs> All right, we got the compass. It'll tell me if a key is nearby. Now I'm convinced there's going to be holes everywhere. Get away from these bombs. Ooh, ah. Um, oh. At my work's holiday party, we had a, a theme where we, it was like Studio 54 themed. And when you were going in, you gave they gave us these bags of fake drugs. Like they looked like they look they just looked like drugs. <laughs> uh, and they got handed to you in a in a in a in a slick way. And my friend and I were talking about it at a sushi restaurant and she was like, Yeah, and then the and then the that guy gave me a little bag of coke and the person next to us was like <laughs> They were not fucking having it. They did not enjoy the story. You're notorious for finding the compass right before the boss. I, that so far has been the case. This is the first time I found the the uh, compass early. The downside being that I also, oh my god, found the... I just found the nightmare key and I don't have, I haven't done like a third of the fucking thing. Boom. Teamwork. I'm a street hustler. There's a key somewhere here. How do I get there? Can I long jump over the fence? No. In Heart Gold Soul Server, you can get now used for like $60, just like Sword and Shield. The main difference is that at least you get your money's worth. 
Fair enough. You know what, though? I was a being... Oh, look. I bet I can go through here. Look at that. That connects. Okay. That's why this pathway exists. I was wondering why this pathway existed. Um, I was being a hater about Pokemon Sword and Shield before I got it, but it was actually... It was fun. I liked it. I'm not going to pay DLC for it. That's ridiculous. That's highway robbery, if you will. But, you know. Dude, the long jump is so fun. A little wind up for it. So cute. If you want to learn the hip drug slang, download the Whisper app and then read all the local whispers. I don't even. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I would not enjoy that. I wonder if there was any other way that I was supposed to pick up that there was a passageway there. Get him, get him, get him. Nope. Oh, thank god. I think that's all I can do for this section. I need a jar. I need a jar. We should go gambling after this, you guys. Not in real life, but at the crane game. I am addicted to the crane game. If you weren't here last time, I fucking love the crane game. I can't help myself. Oh, maybe I should just go up this way. Instead of starting the whole thing over again. Although, is this just gonna... Connect down to... God damn it. I shouldn't have done this. Did I just softlock myself? I hope not. This game, I mean, it wouldn't let you softlock yourself, right? Surely? Surely? Oh, what am I trying to do? What's down here? This is just a big circle. There's a rumor that Nintendo and Game Freak are moving to the same building, and Breath of the Wild team is going to help with Pokemon Gen 9. That would be awesome. That sounds amazing. What? What? I, yeah, I just, so I never cared about Dexit or whatever, you know, people were very upset about, people were very upset about the Pokedex getting shortened. I didn't mind that, because, like I said, I've never really finished a Pokemon game since the, probably since, like, Gen, Gen 3 or 4, uh, so there's a lot of Pokemon that I just kind of neglect anyway. So not be not knowing who they are, I don't really care about losing them. And this encouraged me to play with Pokemon that I normally neglect. So if I go there, I'm still going to need one more key. Let's see if the compass tells me anything. <laughs> what, ain't what the truth? I'm... <laughs> Listen, guys, we don't have a pill problem. We haven't played Isaac on the stream in 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 weeks. <laughs> There's no problems here. No problems here. This feels like something where I'm probably supposed to be figuring out a puzzle. Mostly just because of the fact that the owl is there. But I don't know how to talk to the stinky owl because he has no mouth. I have no mouth and I must give hints. That's the title of my new novel. Okay, let's... We'll just go open a side door, because I don't want to get stuck here. We'll go back to the main entrance and go in one of those other doors. Sup, Vodka? Look at that lurking little Moogle. I've been think thinking a lot lately about how I want a Moogle tattoo. I have no tattoos, and I've wanted one for a while. And I was like, I really don't know what I would, what I would want one of. What's something that I've always liked, and I think I will always like, and I think Final Fantasy might be an answer to that. So I think a Moogle might be the answer. <laughs> I can stop whenever I want to, I just don't feel like it. I've actually gotten a lot better about taking pills in my Binding of Isaac runs, though. 
it's it's uh, had some I've had some good runs ruined by taking bad pills, so I'm a little warier. Grub in a hat. You hope that rumor is true? You want to see open routes and cave connecting to each other from all over the place? It would be really cool. I mean, any sort of fresh perspective on Pokemon would be nice. Because, like, even though I wasn't disappointed by Pokemon Sword and Shield, I will say, like, Gigantamaxing is pretty lame. Okay, where do you teleport to, friend? Can I just hit you with a... Oh, that's way easier than what I was doing before. Out of context, this combo is wild. Which one? The pills? Pills, pills, pills. Can you take my pills? Can you take my automobile pills? Let's get out of here. He yahoos. Today, vodka. Someone said yeehaw to me, and I almost said he yaw back to them in in, in a work chat, like not in, not out loud. Uh, <laughs> and I uh, and then I was like, they will not know what I mean, and so I didn't do it. Okay. That's not right. I mean, it was close. It was close-ish. Wrong one! Damn. Okay, let's try this again. Ooh, bonked. Bonked, you nerd. Okay, this, they go zigzaggy. Poo vibes! You have an important question. If I could marry one video game character, who would it be? No! Ah, oh, poo vibes. This is all poo vibes' fault. <laughs> it's been a long time, poo vibes. How are you? Um, if I can marry one video game character, that's really hard. Uh, uh, I would marry the grub from Hollow Knight. Just kidding. Um, <laughs> I think it's a baby. <laughs> I don't want to marry a baby. The doctor from Persona. No, that is a good choice though. Um. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I listen. <laughs> Maybe I have an answer, but I don't want to tell everybody because it's gonna get misconstrued. It's gonna get misconstrued and <laughs> turned against me in a court of law. <laughs> it's not shadow. No, it's not cloud. Not cloud. Cloud is kind of milk toast. The big grub ate them all. Yeah, so I'd marry the big grub, so then I marry every grub. <laughs> the pervy teddy bear from that one game where you fight people subconscious. <laughs> oh, man. We can't marry Teddy. We abandoned Teddy. What is milk toast? Milk toast is just kind of like. I think it's. I think I know what it means. Let's look it up. Milk toast. It's with a Q U E. Milk. Milk. A timid or feeble person. Feeble. Insipid. Insipid. Bland. That's how I meant it. Like, bland. Teddy Fox. <laughs> oh, Mary Hunk from Resident Evil 2. <laughs> go with a hack. You're gonna go with a hack answer and say Zelda? So here's... Okay, here's, here's the answer that I thought of for you guys. But you have to hear me out. And there is no misquoting of this... In any in any way, shape, or form, you would marry Link. Link doesn't talk. I would, maybe that's what you want in your life. <laughs> I went the this. Is, I meant to go check something else out before I came back this way. Uh, no, I will delete the clip. I'll delete it. So listen. <laughs> so listen. You know who has a really cool personality, but unfortunately is an animal. <laughs> Red 13 from Final Fantasy 7. So if you could turn Red 13 into a into a human first, I think that would be a good candidate for marriage. <laughs> but that's the thing. I wouldn't want to marry a dog. <laughs> who, do you, who do you think I am? Oh, I went the wrong way. This is what I knew was gonna happen. This is what I knew was gonna happen. No quoting. <laughs> That's a lot of fucking money. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Gio, thank you. 
A dog, you say? Get out of town. Listen up, you guys know what I mean. You know what I mean. And you all probably wanted to have sex with characters from the Ro from Robin Hood as kids or something. <laughs> hot dog. Hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. There was another one of these somewhere. That was blocked in by a blue crystal. It was here. It's a new world. Undoubtedly. See? There's the map. There's the map. You'd be lying if you hadn't said that <laughs> Lola Bunny is a babe. See? You had a crush on Trent from Daria. I don't know enough about Daria. I only know who Daria and her friend are. What was going on with that dog from Final Fantasy VII was a bit on the edge for a T-rated game. That's very true. But he was only doing it because he was a prisoner. He apologized afterwards. He apologized. Like a gentleman. <laughs> like a gentle dog. It's why you don't play Animal Crossing. You can't confront yourself. Uh, let's see what this owl has to say. Now that we have a beak. <laughs> I want to fuck the dog. <laughs> oh, no! Don't, don't! No! Oh, what have I done? <laughs> I realized that once I said that, someone's going to clip it immediately. <laughs> It's what the owl was saying, you guys. The owl said it. The owl said it. Far away, do not fear, dash and fly. I don't know what that means. <laughs> don't do it, Dusty. Don't do it. <laughs> oh, man, what have I done? <laughs> what have I gotten myself into? I feel like I'm turning red, but you guys can't tell because I have the <laughs> the hue lights. Bless God bless the Philips hue. Philip J. Hugh, thank you. Oh, man. Why am I the way that I am? Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think I've talked about before, though, my first video game character that I was like, like, ooh, was Gipple from Final Fantasy X-2. Riku's X. This is a learning stream. You guys are bullying me. You're bullying me, the bully. Okay. We need one more key. Let's go talk to... There is an owl in that room with the bomb. And sometimes this game likes to give you stuff that's not really a puzzle. So much as it is... Kill these things in the right order. <laughs> And by sometimes, I mean one time it did that. Everyone's quiet because they're clipping. Better not be. I'll go offline. Immediately. Mary Rosalina from Mario Galaxy? Leave me alone! I can't believe Pooh Vibes just came in and did that to me. First, she got me killed. To defeat the black monsters with the hard shell, feed them something explosive. We already did that. Unless it means these bombs. What did that other one say? Like something like, up and away, fly. We're missing one key. She is a monster. <laughs> Riku's ex is a stud. RJ from Over the Hedge. What is Over the Hedge? How do you make a formal request for a nut? No. That's not happening. <laughs> Stacks. Not a thing. How have I not seen Over the Hedge? It okay, so it's a movie. <laughs> We've established it's a movie. What year did it come out? And is it a children's movie? Because that sounds like a children's movie that I probably haven't seen. Um, did I miss something obvious? We have the compass. <gasps> I did miss something obvious. Look at that room right there.
2006, an old bad animated movie today that nobody remembers but Dusty. <laughs> okay, yeah. In 2006, I would have been a sophomore in high school. So, uh, no, I was not watching animated children's movies because I was too cool for school. I can't believe I missed this super obvious section. You can't even say that over the hedge is bad? I mean, I can't say that because I've never seen it. Oh, God. What the f what in the f hell am I supposed to do here? You've never met someone that doesn't know over the hedge. Maybe if I saw the preview, I'd recognize it. But I feel like there were a lot of movies like that came out that looked exactly like Ice Age and weren't Ice Age. Probably describe it as average. Maybe I'm supposed to throw a bomb at this thing? It has heart. Nope, not the way. Maybe I just keep running and don't jump. Ah, uh, that's the... No, no, no! Link, stop! Link! There we go, oh my god. Oh, I think that was the final key we needed. Hopefully. Let me out of here. We made it! You can't think of this movie. There was a cartoon movie where a human is turned into some sort of animal and there's a female version of that animal who falls in love with him and they get sad when he turns back into a human. That does sound familiar. Does that happen in Rockadoodle? The Nemo copies. You have to go to the store to get change. What year is it? I want to say that there's a character that likes the 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 kid in Rockadoodle, but maybe I'm misremembering. Um, but that does sound familiar. Okay, we have ourselves a little thwomp. He likes six years old, though. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> that little jump noise. Your son needs money for the book fair. Ah. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh -huh. Oh, we can kill these things that way now, too. Always looking for a fun way to kill clown birds. You're, yeah, I wouldn't give a, uh, a child my credit card. No way, no how. Book fair day is seriously like a, a universally great memory. Okay, we have the nightmare key. Why is it- why did another key drop? The nightmare room is right there. Let's figure it out. Someone asked a question on Google. Is Pikachu a chinchilla? I think Pikachu might be a chinchilla. That day's like smelled better? Oh yeah, it smelled better. Yes, everything about it was better. Neener neener, you can't find me. Yeah, yeah. Are you a cat? Okay, well, I see your giant shadow, weirdo. Am I supposed to do something to get it down? Is it just gonna fall eventually? Hello? Maybe I can use the dust? Maybe not. Maybe not. Thank you for the follow, Papa Post. Hello. Hello. <laughs> I'm currently being stumped by this boss. Let's see. That- the dust doesn't seem to do anything. Let's go back to the bomb. Sword in the stone? They were squirrels? Oh, you know what? That's right. I That's why I knew it was like a movie that I had seen. 
My sister really liked Sword in the Stone, but I was, um, hold on a second, sorry. Um, I was never, like, big into Sword in the Stone, although I did love trying to pull the sword out of the stone at Disney Parks. <laughs> Great choice for a gift, thank you. I'm very, I'm very proud of that alert, I like it a lot. It's wholesome, it's quick, it's to the point. And it gets stuck in your head. Howdy, howdy, howdy. I also love Toy Story. I remember going to see Toy Story in the theaters. <laughs> I don't know why I said the that way. Okay. I don't really... I don't know what this game wants from me. There are arrows on the ground here. But they don't seem to do anything. Oh god. Your parents hated you so you didn't get to see Toy Story in the theaters? Ah. But you know what? Now you're an adult and you can buy Disney Plus if you want to. You can watch Toy Story till the end of time. And thank you for the bits, by the way. Muchas gracias. Okay, this is not this is not the answer. That's why there's arrows. Yep. Whatever, whatever, I do what I want. Slime eye. It was good. Nothing can top three, though. <laughs> That's the animal you would whip, Mary. <laughs> the squirrel. What is this? Can I break this? Maybe I have to bomb it? No? We did learn that we could, like, jump. Oh, I probably have to do the thing I just learned. Duh. That's the thing, is that you're always supposed to, like, use the thing you just learned. That makes sense. <laughs> it looks like boobs. It does a little bit. I'm gonna die, probably? Yeah. I wasted a lot of health trying to figure out how to... How to even get this boss down. Woo! Oh, god, yep, there we go. Yeah, Toy Story 3 I saw twice in theaters, and each time I cried. <gasps> I forgot we had let the lady give us a weird sneaky massage. Alright. This is actually kind of tough, a tough fight so far. I would say this is the toughest boss fight so far. Alright, well thanks for stopping by to say hi, Papa Post. Smell you later. Oh. I thought we were going to have to keep breaking it down further and further. You were 15 when Toy Story came out, so you probably thought you were too cool for it. Plus you were mad at computer animation because you wanted to be a traditional animator. Yeah, that's that's reasonable. Everyone was kind of like iffy at first about computer animated stuff. You got a heart container. Yay. Did, did she touch his sword? She may have. You got the sea lilies bell. That's how I play the bell. <laughs> this person plays a sick bell jam. You went to see Toy Story 3 with your mom because you were pissed your friend your group of friends went to go see grown ups. I definitely saw grown ups in the theater as well. I didn't read that. It is hidden in the waterfall. Did anybody else... Was there something else I needed to pick up on besides waterfall? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, maybe the owl will tell us. I was busy reading that Melf got in her car <laughs> and accidentally <laughs> had me hooked up to her Bluetooth. Sorry to scare you. I got Lily's bell. What's that supposed to mean? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Hoot. How many instruments have you gotten so far? When you play the instruments in front of the egg, the windfish will wake and you will leave this island. Now you must go. You must hasten to the Yarna Desert. The dark, monstrous inhabitants of the sand will show you the way. Hoot hoot. Let's go back to town first. <laughs> I've definitely been guilty of leaving my phone on for stuff. So let's see now. We can probably... Let's backtrack a little bit before we go to the desert. I would like to see what's over there. Can I make this jump? Nope. <laughs> the drowning noise is so funny. 
You don't know why, but laying down and drinking pop makes you sad. I don't- oh, you like, you actually get sad. I was gonna say, I don't like to lay down and drink anything. It, like, hurts my throat. Uh, it's not good. Not good. That's interesting, though, that it bums you out. Wonder why that is. The world may never know. Let's go see if anything new is in the store. And, actually, we can- if we go back to... That, uh... The field? I think we can get to that heart container now. Or the piece of heart. Which means... That we can... Get a health upgrade. Oh man. I can't do that though. I have to go all the way back around. What's a PFP? I don't know what that means. Yesterday you were borrowing your roommate's truck to move your dirt bike and as you were pulling it back in the driveway his phone connected to Bluetooth and started blasting porn. I feel like I hear those stories often. I don't know wh who these people are that are leaving tabs up in their phone, but whenever I'm done on my phone, no matter what I was doing, I close out all tabs. Profile pic. Oh, yeah. Yes. I love this profile pic. Alright, look at this. We're almost halfway to being able to afford the bow and arrow, legitimately. One of my friends just, like, drew that picture and sent it to me one time after a stream. And I, uh, probably should have asked him permission, but I just was like, I'm gonna start using this. <laughs> what? He was in the horn- the horn? In the ho in the house watching porn on his phone. You drove close enough that it automatically connected to the- oh. I didn't even put that together. Ah. There we go. You got four pieces of heart. Health upgrade. Look at how much health we have, you guys. We're flush with health. We're drowning in it. Whoops. <laughs> We're drowning in the ground. He took your likeness. That's enough permission. That's true. That's true. someone watching porn in the library and VR and didn't have their headphones plugged in. So, uh, I don't know if you've ever been to the computer area of a public library, but people do not care. <laughs> people do not care. Either they uh, There's two extremes. It's like, either they, they do not care at all what you're doing on the computer, or what they're doing on the computer and whether you see them, or they, uh, they care way too much, and they're like, quit trying to look at me! <laughs> All right, let's see where this goes. Hmm. Can I make this jump? You had turned up the volume for music, but instead you got Zelda sound effects in person. Okay, well that's, this jump is not happening for us yet. Health update. Bonk. <laughs> Quiet, this is a library. <laughs> yeah, just try a couple more jumps. <laughs> Listen up, Tudor McGavin. You and Pooh vibes are on thin ice. I want that. Okay. Let's... Let's see what's at the crane game. Before we get too much money on our hands. Okay, I want that. Yeah. Trendy game. Aw, uh, did you see how many uh, rupees we just had? It's like 420, bro. <laughs> I love this game. Oh, no. That's gonna knock out. Oh, good. Perfection. Some might even go so far as to say perfectamundo. 
give me a holler. All right. A spiny figure made with real metal spikes. Let's go find where we're supposed to leave it. You're dreading for 2020, the amount of annoying potheads posting shit on Facebook. Oh, no, no, no. I'm sorry. Don't attack me, chickens. Um, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't really check my Facebook. And anybody that I, put, I follow on Twitter probably will not care. <laughs> Let's see where the spiny thing goes. Piranha plants... There's a lot of places for stuff. Let's go up to the house that has like 8 million kids. And I bet they had a few spots up there. That's a lot of fucking money. <laughs> Thank you for the bits, Tutor McGavin. Trying to- are you, you and Poo Vibes trying to buy my forgiveness? Give for, why can't I talk? Forgiveness? <laughs> Just kidding. Thank you, I appreciate it. How do I get to that one? It says spiny. Place the spiny figure here? Yes. I wonder what happens when we fill out all these things. I wonder. Let's... I don't think I've gone in here. Dream shrine? It's very bright. <laughs> My flaws. <laughs> don't look at them. What? That looks like the thing from Kirby. <gasps> what is this? Your old person knee hurts from the incoming so snowstorm? That happens to me. Oh my god. Can If I go to bed again, do I like start this over with full health? No. What the hell? <laughs> Maybe I'm supposed to... You know what? If we die, we die. My guys. <laughs> Let's try it. I have a strategy. I have an idea. That is such a pleasant sound. There we go. Haven't I ever watched Nightmare on Elm Street? I have not. I didn't even watch the original Halloween till... Uh... Like, right before the remake came out this year. Or last year. We got it. By God, we've done it. If you die in your dream, you die in real life. Oh my God. An ocarina? Is that an ocarina? 100 rupees. You're happy. I'm happy. The game is right. I am happy. Yeah, we wrecked him. Plowed right to him. You got the ocarina. You should learn to play many songs. Excellent. Does this do anything? No? Alright. Can I break- Oh. I was like, how do I get back all the I don't want to go all the way around. There we go. That's his head 64 controller. <laughs> Let's see if What's-Her-Face uh, can teach us any songs. We suck. Well, it's an ocarina, but you don't know how to play it. Well, thanks, game. Also, I don't think we've talked to this little kid. Hey, hey, bro. What about the dream shine there? They say there's something good inside. I better not say anything else, because I'm just a kid. <laughs> I love that these kids are all like, I don't know, I'm just a kid. <laughs> hey, that's a nice ocarina you have there. Will you accompany me as I sing? Oh, we picked this up fast.
I don't know if I'm supposed to interrupt this. So, how do you like it? It's really touching. Does it stick in your mind? Yes. You've learned the Ballad of the Windfish. This song will always remain in your heart. I wonder what that means. Please remember this song. You should play it every once in a while to keep it fresh in your mind. I wonder what that does. It doesn't budge an inch. I want to move that so bad. I want to see if we can catch that. Uh... There's a jar at the bottom of this fishing pond. And it's starting to become apparent that maybe I should catch a fairy here and there. Okay, hold A and release it to cast your line out. The longer you hold it, the further you'll cast. Tug on your line. Okay, we got this. We got this, you guys. Where is it? Oh, it reset. We had it last time. But then it, like, the big fish intercepted it. So we have to figure out how to not have the big fish intercept it. Can't get the big fish to bite my own line to save my life, but... Okay, we'll wait till it turns around. Oh, bastard. Whoops, you'll get it next time, little buddy. I want to try again. I do. Oops, that's not far enough at all. No, no, I don't want you. <laughs> Okay, now we got to avoid catching a fish on the way down. I think I didn't throw it far enough this time. No, 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 no. Damn it. <laughs> Maybe I'm going to give up on this jar after all. Let's see if we can catch this fish. I think I need a better lure. Scratch that. I am a master fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> You're a little big fish. It's so heavy, you wish you'd caught something lighter. Ooh, a 35.03 inch fish. That's a lunker. That's worth 26 rupees. For landing a lunker, I'll set you up with a new lure. Ooh. We got the middleweight lure. The fish a little deeper down will love this one. This is the first time you landed one this size, huh? Let's mark the occasion with a piece of heart. Boom. Alright. Want to keep going? Yeah, let's change lures. I wonder if I need the better lure to... Because the fish down at the bottom is... It's smaller than the fish we just caught, I feel like. But maybe I can catch the... The jar with it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Vodka. It's a certifiable GG moment. I don't want you, fish. I don't want you. No! Alright. You're no lunker. Oh. That one got away. But you know what? Now it's out of the way. We can get this jar. <laughs> I really want this jar, you guys. In case you couldn't tell by how often I've said the word in the last five minutes. Come on. Come on. Here we go. Come on. What's this GG nonsense? What do you mean? Like, are you asking what GG means? Here come more fish. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! Butthead. That's not far enough at all. We're so close. Oh, my God. Uh, GG means good game. So sometimes people will say, even though it means good game, some people will say it after like an achievement of some sort. That's a butt. Come on, you're almost down. No! I wish I could make it sink faster. Come on. Let 
We got this. We got this now. I was gonna say, if that thing auto targets on me from way over there, now it makes sense. I'm happy to have enlightened you, my friend. gonna get it. I don't think it's gonna happen. I think now I'm in a spot where no matter what this stupid fish is gonna... I guess I could just catch this fish. And then he's out of the way. And then we should be free and clear. I don't gotta dream bigger than that. Hey, we still made a profit. Okay, so we just have to hurry up and do it before another fish spawns. I know that I've probably invested way too much time and rupees into getting this jar, but now it's just on the principle. Oh my god, here comes another fish! Oh my god, there we go. You hold up a fairy bottle! It's good for storing fairies for later! No, I do not want to keep going. <laughs> I am all fished out indeed. Whew. Let's see what this does. Okay. <laughs> I'm not sure what it did. Where am I supposed to be going now? The desert. I'm guessing these roughly drawn things are the desert. Like, is this... Oh, is that the desert? No, that's mountains. This looks like a desert. Should we see if we can go there? I say we see if we can go there. We'll make our way that way. Um, Swap out for the shovel. You love the inclusions of bottles in the remake? Oh, the original did not have bottles? I know a lot of Zelda games did have bottles, but I have not played the original of this. That's surprising. The bottles are very handy. In fact, since I know where a fairy cave is, I should go bottle one real quick, and then we'll head down. You don't think the OG did? Dang. Oh no! I need to be careful not to accidentally heal, my heal myself. Hey, little fairy. Perfect. I will not set you free. You're mine forever. <laughs> you won't go anywhere. Okay, let's look at the map one more time. If we've learned anything from Hollow Knight, it's that the map stays in my brain for 10 seconds. Okay, I gotta go to the right and then down is what it looks like. Oh, you know when I blew up that skull thing earlier and couldn't figure out what it unlocked? It just unlocked this path. Duh. <laughs> oh, vodka. No! Butthead. Pothole field. I didn't even realize that place was called Pothole field. Um, let's go around. That's the castle. What's this sign for? Animal Village, Martha's Bay. Neither of these sound like where I need to go, but I am interested to find out. Let's see if we can make this jump. I don't think I can. That was a terrible jump. You didn't get bullied too much? Weren't you telling us last time about you doing the bullying? Didn't you put like gum in someone's hair or something? <laughs> I can't remember what it was. Hey. Those flying things are not easy for me. I cannot get them. Ta 
That was only that once. It was her pencil case. That's it. And you were real cool for doing it. I want to figure out how to get those. Oh, I have an eyelash in my eye, you guys. You were never the bully or the get bullied? That's good. Just live your life. Ah, ah. There has to be a way to kill these. Can I flip them over? Nope. I tried to bomb them last time. That didn't work. So let's see if... Oops, no. Does this do anything? Nope. Oh! I just have to be faster. The answer all along was to just get good. And we've done it. Perfect. You were both you bullied to prevent getting bullied. Kids do a lot of things. Skull crabs, my favorite. Ah! Like, now I just need to figure out how to do it without getting hurt. Oh god. How do I hit these? They, they drop bombs. Let's see what the hint guy has to say, by the way. Just skate better. All you have to do is skate better. You're browsing Twitch to distract you from being sick? Note, it isn't working? Aw. Oh, I'm sorry, Tank. That sucks. It's that it, it seems like it is really going around right now, though. Flu season and all. In the Yarna Desert, which is located in the southeast of the island. Southeast, okay. You will find something called the Angler Key. Okay. So the southwest. Oh, we're... Can I not tell directions? Maybe he said southeast. Let's read that again. Southeast. Okay, I was like, I am in the southwest. <laughs> this is not the desert. Okay, so we'll just head east. Yeah, being sick sucks. You lose- it feels like you lose so much time. You can't get anything done that you want to. But, on the bright side, you never feel better than right after you've been sick. Like, and then you feel better again, you're like, I can do anything! <laughs> Um, let's change out of that. I should be digging more often, I feel like. Also, my health. My health is not good. But I have the fairy. Always look on the bright side of life. Doo -doo. I don't think I can go in here. This is not the way. How? Hmm. Do I have to go all the way up and then down? Because I don't have a way to be in the water right now. Can I go all the way up and then back down? That seems excessive. It is also a great time to catch up on everything you've missed. This drowning noise is so good. We all know coronavirus comes from the lime you stick into the corona. Very true. Um, I have no idea what they're doing for their trip. Stacks. Also, they wouldn't be going back to China. They've never been to China. <laughs> Alright, we gotta figure something out. What is this? Okay, Martha's Bay. Let's go, let's see what's in this house. Oh man, why do you think they wouldn't be leaving the States? Okay, here we go. No, we went to, to we went to Tokyo, which is in Japan. <laughs> 
More seashells. You're supposed to go to the character select screen and then choose Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh no. Um, the door to the cabinet is hanging off its hinges. Nobody's used this in a long while. Can I blow it up? Let's see. Can we blow it up? Welp. <laughs> that was not the answer. Not supposed to go down. Can we light the fire? There's a little... There is a little lantern thingy. Oh! This feels relevant. Now can I check this? No. Okay, well I don't know what I'm supposed to do in here. You went to Japan land in China? <laughs> you love how under the house is just a black abyss, yeah. That's how they excavate. That beep boop thing reminds you of Wii Fit. Nothing like standing on the Wii Fit board and having to go, oh! Bum, 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 bum. You're obese. <laughs> we fit. <laughs> we fit is so funny. You're obese. Have you guys ever seen the clips of it doing that? Okay, this is where we found here. Nope. I feel like I'm probably supposed to find some sort of item to help me on my journey. Oh god. Bloop. We'll just explore and see what we can find. And if we don't find anything down here, we'll swing all the way around. Right? Yes, the music to this game is amazing. Who is this? Someone's snoring. When we first came in. Oh, maybe I woke it up? Your brother also happens to be sick. You haven't yet synced up your coughs, but you're close. How? Okay, it's not a snore. Nope, nope, nope. I don't know what to do here. Oh well. We'll go back. We are officially puzzled. I'm gonna go... Or we're gonna go up to the tippy top of the map and see if we can go all the way around. We're trying to get to the desert. The game when you were younger would always say you were overweight. The thing didn't realize back then, every time you played Weed Fit, you'd play, eaten a good breakfast before then. Oh! <laughs> Where are you from, dude? Outside the island. Oh, we already talked to you about this. <laughs> Wonder what to do. That is a great use of emotes. <laughs> Vodka. I love that. Okay, let's... Man. I don't see a way... up... to then go over. That's the only thing. And we, we can go to the castle... 
Unless I am supposed to be able to make this jump. Remember I was trying to make that jump and I couldn't? Maybe I am supposed to be able to make that jump. It would call your dad obese, but your dad was just tall with broad shoulders. That's a problem for tall people in general. Like BMI charts and stuff. I'm not saying that's my problem. <laughs> I'm just saying in general that is a consideration. Is there anything in the store that we need? You realized you had this game on the Game Boy and this is just a remake? Yes it is. Yes it is in fact a remake. Boink. Boink. <laughs> you might have a case of the dumb. No, I mean, they did completely remake it, so you're good. Yes, we fit very judgy. Okay, let's go over here to the Seashell Mansion. And we'll check in at the Seashell man Mansion. I have gotten a few more seashells, so maybe we're up to the next level now. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> never played this game, but you bought a poster of the cover art since you liked it? Hey, Matthias. Remember, um, who was it earlier who was complimenting the profile picture? Was it you, Captain Dingput? Matthias is the one who drew that picture. Oh, you saw it? You were here. You were lurking. It's such a good picture. People compliment it pretty often. Oh, I was asking Dingpot if you were the one who had who were who was saying that you liked the profile picture. Oh, you saw on Twitter. You didn't see it here. Yeah, no. Someone was just talking about it here today. Oh, I would never have to ask if Captain Dingpot's cool. We all know Captain Dingpot's cool. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. Oh! <gasps> Jesus. You're up early since you have jet lag from Japan. You went to Japan? I didn't know you went to Japan. That's super awesome. How'd you love it? Did you love it? Did you love it? It's the greatest, right? It's the best. <laughs> Did you go to Tokyo, Sapporo? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Only your secret Instagram followers know. You got a Finsta, my dude? I was going to go back to Japan in December, but uh, I got sick and I missed too much time at work and spent too much money, so I didn't get to go anymore. I had to cancel. Well, I could have gone, but it would have been fiscally irresponsible, so I canceled. <laughs> you're not cool. You're hella sick. Very true. Animal Village. You went to Tokyo. You're kind of expecting to go there and let all your weeb dreams die, but in case instead you became a full weeb. No, that's the thing is, I feel like it lives up to the hype. It's it's so cool. Everything there is great. Hoot. There are two shrines, one to the north, the other to the south. First, head south, where ancient ruins speak of the wind fish. You will learn much there. Okay. I was gonna go to the down, but now I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> we'll figure it out. We're supposed to be going to a desert. Bonk. I don't think I'm allowed to go to the animal village after our conversation earlier tonight. I'm glad you had a good time. If you have any cool stuff that you are willing to spread outside your finsta, you should send it to me. Yes! Finally we killed one of those things. Hey. Hey, you. Can I go in this water? Nope. Too deep. And I'm in too deep. And I'm trying to keep Link from drowning in here. It's one thing to be a weeb in Japan. It's another to be a weeb in Japan and expect all the waifus. <laughs> Don't be a waifu chaser. Yeah, I mean, that's fair. Yeah, like, you can, you can, I feel like it's okay to be an inner weeb. You know, like, be excited on the inside that you're in Japan and everything. But if you're, like, trying to be, like, <laughs> like I'm an otaku to the locals, like, it's kind of like, ugh. <laughs> it's, 
It's all about knowing how to act. I'm excited though, I wanna go back. I, I was hoping I could maybe swing going back this winter since I wasn't able to go last winter, but, or I guess this winter, it's still going on. Uh, but we'll see, we'll still have to see how it comes. How things shake out. Cause I need a car, I need consistent AC, baby. All right, Tuner, don't fall in. Hey. You're only there for a week. You want to go back for longer? That's exactly. When we went, we went for like five days or so, and I want to go back and spend a decent amount of time there. Like I'd like to go for two weeks and spend time in Kyoto. The wind fish slumbers long. The hero's life gone. Okay. We'll go back the other way then. What's up, Ultros? Ancient ruins. Yeah, exactly. You can get a lot done, but there's sh there's just so much. There's so much to do. It's amazing. Ugh. Let's let's do this later. <laughs> let's go back the way I was gonna go. <laughs> Boom. It's always fun to me to go to other touristy cities since I'm from a touristy place. I like being the one to go act like a tourist. <laughs> hey, Garbage. Welcome to my stream. Do not hit the electric pickles. Welcome to the animal village. Ah, oh, on such a nice day, we need a song from Marin. I know a song from her. I feel like I've done a lot of stuff on accident in the right way. Oh, what? That song wasn't good enough for you? No? You're from Florida, everything is a tourist location, even in your small town. I feel like nobody's trying to go to like Jacksonville <laughs> for tourist business. You're in a desert. There's a way to get there to the south, but you might not be able to get through if that lazy walrus is in the way. I like that these guys are just collecting carrots and lettuce. <laughs> it's definitely a, a rabbit's home. I did progress. We beat the third temp uh, the th temple. We beat the third dungeon today. First things first. And then we got we did the dream shrine. And now we just hit Animal Village. Go away, rude. This looks like the crocodile from Banjo Kazooie. <laughs> I am Shul Donovich. The mermaid statue by the bay is my masterpiece. <laughs> to tell you the truth, that work is not complete. The art, it's difficult for you to grasp, is it not? Why are all these animals rude assholes? <laughs> Gabe, is that the crocodile's name? <laughs> I take that to mean that that emote vodka that you want to marry the crocodile or the hippo mo the hippo model. You don't know the proper etiquette when dealing with a lady, do you? You should have brought flowers or something. Then I might be more inclined to talk with you. Oh yes, in my case, hibiscus are best. Okay. We have a honeycomb. So we need to find someone to trade the honeycomb with. Hippos are your type. Hey, did you know Animal Village and Mabe Village are sister cities? Yes, even though they aren't large enough to be called cities. Anyway, I heard from a very good source that they have a dream shine in Mabe. And that's something good inside. Yep, we already got it. You need more of these emotes? I have a decent amount of those. What is making those noises when we come into some of these rooms? I would like to know. Maybe if I play the ocarina when something does that? The croc is named Mr. Vile. You're right. That sounds familiar now that you say that. Hmm. The borks sound like Gabe. Like Gabe Newell? Gaben? I can't go to Mabe Village because of all the monsters. I hope Marin is alright. 
Why don't these guys care that I'm playing her song? <laughs> He's uh, Mr. Dial, Mr. Vile the Crocodile. <gasps> this bear is so cute. Hi ho! Hey you, is that possibly a honeycomb you have? I just ran out. Will you swap it for a pineapple? Absolutely. This is like the ultimate trade up for us. A pineapple versus a honeycomb? Hi ho! Yeah, I know that tub of goo is asleep, is right in the way to Yarna. Once he's asleep, he won't budge for a long time. But hey, take little Marin and wake him up with her singing. That slob would wake up with the jump if you he heard her sing, for sure. <laughs> okay, so we have to probably play the song for him. The bear is pretty cute, though. I unleashed something in you guys, and I regret it. I regret my actions. Ba -da -da -da. Entrance to Yarna Desert. My shoulder. My shoulder, it hurts. That didn't work. I don't know how to bring her with us other than by playing her song. The pineapple is more equal to the whole beehive. Hmm. <laughs> Bees included. I don't like pineapple. I do not enjoy it. Okay. We gotta figure out how to how to take Marin with us. I did not activate the little portal. Oh, hey. What do you got for us here? Bonk. Pineapple on pizza? I don't, see, I don't have an opinion on that argument because I don't like pineapple. So obviously I would say don't put it on your pizza because I don't like it. When you had guinea pigs, you bought fresh pineapple all the time and they and ate so much of it your mouth got raw. Oh yeah, it's a, it can do that to you. I understand. I understand, game, what you would like from me. Monk. <laughs> the noise is so pleasant. Oh! <laughs> well, 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 well. Am I supposed to be able to make this jump? I feel like I'm supposed to be able to make this jump. Not like that. <laughs> That's how I feel right now. Oh, is there a hook shot maybe? You could be right. You could be right. We'll leave it alone for now. Instead of wasting all my health. I don't mind you coming here and wasting all my health. You don't actually know, but no, most Zelda games have hook shots. I mean, that's true. Most Zelda games do have hook shots. Excellent. Well, you know what? We compensated by getting this this piece of heart instead. Hmm. I would have thought that just by playing that song should be enough. I don't... We'll go see if talking to Marin changes anything. Um, also, let's activate. I thought, oh, there is a thing. Tap, 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 tap. Most Zelda games have hookers. I don't know about that. The Gerudo are strong, powerful women, Ultros. 
Coucou. <laughs> the great fairies in Breath of the Wild look like drag queens. Uh oh, she's gone. Yep, yep. Can you tell us where she went? Huh? Marin's not with you. What happened to her? That's not good. We'll see what's at what's happening at her house. Yahoo! I worked too hard and now my broom is worn to the handle. So she needs a new broom. Er, um How to say Please call outside. I don't think we went here before. It seems that old man Olrira is a shy guy in person. <gasps> a shy guy? Wink. I can't believe I didn't go in the house that whole time. Is Taryn in here to tell us what happened to Marin? At the beach. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. Let's go to the beach. Huh. Huh. It's so tempting to hit the chickens, but I know that nothing good comes of hitting the chickens in these games. Nothing good ever came from beating up on little helpless animals in video games. Look at us go. We've come so far since the start of this game. I mean, we're at the beach. Where are you, Marin? There she is. <laughs> Vamos a la playa. Oh, Link, I'm glad you found this place. Will you stay and talk to me for a while? I guess so. Ah, it's so bright when that happens. Where are these little lovebirds? I wonder where these coconut trees come from. Taryn says there's nothing beyond the sea. But I believe there must be something over there. When I discovered you, Link, my heart skipped a beat. I thought, this person has come to give us a message. If I was a seagull, I would fly as far as I could, and then I'd steal someone's french fry on the beach. I would fly to faraway places and sing for many people. She's just like Jenny from Forrest Gump. If I wish to the windfish, I wonder if my dream will come true. She's infinitely more interesting than any iteration of Zelda that I can think of. Hey Link, are you listening to me? Yeah. Something about being a seagull. <laughs> I want to know everything about you. Er, uh, ha 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 ha. Huh? The walrus wants me to go to him? Well, alright, let's go. That was easy enough. <laughs> I, I, I did not expect this. You got Marin. Oh no, is this an escort mission? Okay, we'll go the way we know to go. Um, which... can we? I wonder if we can take her on the portal, actually. Let's find out. That would be easiest. Bonk. Bonk. So I think I was right that we are supposed to play the ocarina for the walrus we just needed an extra we needed an accompaniment you know that's those song lyrics that you typed i'm assuming they're song lyrics vodka because they sound familiar to me but i can't place them those damn dickens oh i was not looking at the screen at all i was just gonna ask you i just read that message what it meant Starships like 
Let's go to the beach. Ah. <laughs> it's I, like uh, the Nicki Minaj song, Starships. I guess while we're here, should we see what's at the crane game? Let's see what's at the crane game. I like to check in it. I like to check in on it. See if we got any fresh, a fresh inventory. A boo. Wow, Link, can I try this? Okay. Oh, I didn't realize like she would get to try on her own. Oh my God, what is she doing? Oh my God, if she just ruined the crane game for me, game for me. What is happening? Oh no. You're good. You're a pro, aren't you? Well, beat it. Pros aren't allowed in here. Oh. I better not be banned from the crane game. I didn't. I truly did not expect that. I just figured we were on the way out of town. Let's go. Okay, so she's not back. Okay, good. Oh. You read an article today where Nikki was asked songs she regrets recording and she said Anaconda and Starship. Starship is... I'm not a big fan of Starship. Oh no, that's bad. Uh, maybe actually... Yeah, it's bad. Oh man. I want that boo. Again, again. Um, it's gonna be too slow. Man, remember yesterday when I got like five in a row, first try? <laughs> Those moments are over. You've never been a big fan of Nicki Minaj? I liked her first album. Okay, let's see this. There we go. I don't like going for the rupees just because it feels like you lose a lot more if you lose, you know? Just give me a holler whenever the mood strikes it play. Give me my boo. What up, Rain? This appears to be a treasured Cristo de la Cristo stream. <laughs> you just missed the Spanish. We were singing in Espanol about going to the beach. Vamos a la playa. A mi me gusta bailar. Oh! I did not mean to hit you. Stupid little fox. You want a boo figurine? Well, only 10 rupees. It could be yours. I did not mean to hit the... I did not mean to hit the fox, you guys. <laughs> I can't believe you've done this. I gotta set up this Twitch things, you guys. I say this every stream. <laughs> you heard Spanish and you were summoned. Hi, Kato. I was just singing Vamos a la Playa. Is this a stand for something? It says Shy Guy. Uh, no, not for you. Boo. Alright, we got our boo, and now we're gonna leave with our other boo. With our side boo. Bonk. What, what happens if I throw a rock at the kid? Anything? Oh. Stupid Marin. Oh. <laughs> oh, a draw a thing. Hold on a second. Let's, let's draw real quick. A, a cute kitty following Link. Let's see. So, in case you guys have never been here for a draw thing, I am extremely bad at drawing. But people still redeem their points for it anyway. So, uh, Link's hat has gotten a little big, you guys. It's gotten a little big for his hat. Or his hat's gotten a little big for him. Oh no! I don't know what skin color that is that I just picked. <laughs> we 
gotta redo that body. That's way too blocky. Oh man. I'm looking at Link on one screen and, and at this on the other. What do you mean bad? The art is amazing. <laughs> yeah, that's why people come. People come for the art. Um, he's just gonna have little boots. Uh, little boots. And a little belt. Oh, and here's a little buckle for him. Boop. And then, um, uh, oh yeah, some, some eyebrows. I tried to do it in the art style of this game. I think I can safely say that I nailed it. <laughs> he has no hands. Look, ma, no hands. Uh, 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 uh. And then... Oh, God. A sword? I assume in the meantime, Tuner has already whipped up a beautiful rendition of this. Is he crying? No, his eyes are just, uh, his eyes are just beady. <laughs> Santa, you lost an elf. What is this? What did you say while I have that shit open, Dusty? You hate when you're working on something with someone and they rush through it and it turns out like shit. Now you gotta type out an email explaining why it sucks. <laughs> the dog person you wanted to marry. Listen, Dusty, I did not want to marry a dog person. The discussion came up earlier of what <laughs> what um what video game character would you marry? And I explained that if you could make Red 13 a human, I would marry Red 13. But I would not marry Red 13 as a dog. The cat has to have the same pink little nose and some little whiskers. Boop, boop. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> there you go. I hope this is sufficient. <laughs> That's a cute kitty following Link. Oh, man. Very whimsical. Is he crying? How could you? How could you? And then what else am I supposed to draw? For Dusty, I'm supposed to draw Red 13. Which is basically like drawing another cat. Oh my god, I can't draw Red 13. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> he has like a flamey tail. That's too hard. <laughs> You guys have to consider sometimes how these are going to be. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. This looks nothing like Red 13 at all. You made my Switch go idle. Um, and then he has a bunch of tattoos. So we'll put like... <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it's it's Juno 13. Sing a song about how you would marry the dog version of uh, of Red 13 in the style of an 80s pop song. Okay, sure. I'll have to think on it while we while we contribute. Yeah, I'm gonna make this. I I, I actually I genuinely have been considering raising the point redemption <laughs> caps on these, you guys. Um, just because sometimes I can get a little backed up on them. Um. 
a song about how you would marry the dog version of Red 13 in the style of an 80s pop song. So the diff the thing is, is that I need to I think I need to turn down the music on this, but I don't think I can. It's going to be hard for me to do with music playing in the background like this. Okay, um... Hmm. Okay. Let me think. Turn around. Red 13. Every now and then I'll fall apart. Turn around. Red 13. Every now and then I'll fall apart. And I need to marry you. If, but only if you were a human. I would not just pet your head. That's it. I don't have any other ideas. That's the end of the- it went blank. It's really hard to do when other music is playing. Sup, Jack? That second picture is better than you would have been able to do. <laughs> the drawings are fun. I don't mind doing them. I really don't. I like doing them. I just- it's really hard to gauge how much stuff should be. <laughs> you see my Red 13 has feline leukemia? <laughs> you asshole. That's really funny. <laughs> it's going pretty well. We're, uh... We were just doing some horrendous drawings. You missed them. So here's my thought, you guys. I have a three-day weekend for President's Day. How would you guys feel about that Sunday maybe doing the Twitch Sing stream? Sunday the 16th. I think that'd be fun. Then I could have some drinks, make it a little more fun. Yes, it's that lazy walrus. Shall we give him a little surprise? Yes. That would be cool. We'll see, we'll see. I mean, you guys just got a little sampling of how that voice sounds, so... <laughs> Know what you're in for. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> aha! Aha! Wow, he certainly woke with a start. Alright, see you later, Dingpot. Thanks for hanging out. Huh? Oh, he's calling me. It's the same as always. Ha <laughs> ha. Link, I'm going to the animal village. Please drop by, okay? We were just there. You can't condone the use of alcohol. The devil's juice is <laughs> getting crazy up in here. Well, I guess I want to go see what they wanted me to stop by the animal village for. Let's see if anything changes now that Marin's here. Oh, wow, they're having like a little party. Please, don't ever forget this song. Or me. It seems to be totally absorbed in Marin's song. Okay, they're all in the zone. That's cute. <laughs> it's the devil's juice. Oh, Tuna McGavin on board? Okay, so I'm thinking a Sunday. I'm thinking that Sunday then probably sounds like a good time. It would be in the evening because I'll probably have to see my parents and my family and stuff earlier in the day. But let's say tentatively a Twitch seeing stream for that Sunday. Bonk, 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 bonk. So I was thinking that Monday would be fun, but then I just have to go to work the next day, so that's not fun. You thought vodka was a sport. A fun sport. Alright, we are officially in the desert, folks. Well, that was lucky. Oh man. It looks like I've gotten pretty far this stream. We Yeah, we beat a dungeon, and then we just got ourselves into the desert. Also, those are the poko the pokes from hmm. what? <laughs> oh, from Mario Three. Yes, yes. You're talking about the cactuses. I thought for some reason when you said pokies, I thought you were talking about Pokemon. <laughs> Mayro. <laughs> Raw fish. Ah, ah, ah. This seems suspicious. Aha! 
What? You thought he meant raw fish? I don't understand that reference. <laughs> it's a me, Mero. Here we go. Sea bears foam, sleep bears dreams. Both end in the same way. Crash. The fuck does that mean? <laughs> that is the least helpful hint. Pokeballs. Oh. Annoyance. You are only getting in the way. What does this mean? I feel like I'll need bombs for this. Okay, bye. I didn't equip them. Do I remember the cartoon Sea Bear and Jamal? No. Oops. Can I get in this? Oh, I can get in this. Oh, I can hit it. I thought there was going to be some trick, but it seems not. Well, you know what the trick is. Don't fall down the sand pit. <laughs> But you know what? Bright side, let's explore. I do remember Proud Family, yes. Bloop. Toast carpet. What are you? S <laughs> I think vodka's. I think vodka's been hitting the devil's juice tonight, you guys. I don't know what vodka's on about. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Round two. You had an unnatural fear of sinkholes as a kid. That's a, um, I don't know if you've ever watched John Mulaney stand up, but he has a, a bit about how, as kids, you always think that quicksand is going to be a much bigger deal than it ends up being later in life. Because you see it a lot in cartoons and shows. I'm scared to fall down the pit again. Because of Princess Bride. Ah. I didn't see Princess Bride as a kid. I only saw it uh, once I was much older. You didn't know... <laughs> Roast on the toast with Lady Carpet. Oh my god, my brain. We're just gonna jump around here. It was a cartoon about a kid and his teddy bear that comes to life. And the bear is voiced by Tone Loke. Really? That's bizarre. No, I've never heard of that in my life. It was lightning sand. <laughs> to be fair, she didn't say quicksand. She said she's been... She was worried of sinkholes. I said quicksand. Oh, dude, yeah. Jungle Book, Never Ending Story. Never Ending Story... This, the... I just recently rewatched Never Ending Story. I loved it as a kid. And I rewatched it and I still loved it. And the Swamp of Sadness or Swamp of Sorrow, whatever it's called, has it hit it, my god, when you're older and you watch that, it's really like and you can grasp what's going on with it, you're like, "Oh my god. Oh my god, the horse is depressed. <laughs> the horse wants to kill itself." I'm not doing this very efficiently. What is this? What is this? I've never read the book, actually. The angler key. Okay. Oh, God. This is... The thing told us about the waterfall. I remember. You were scared of a volcano popping up in the city, like in the movie Volcano? I can't say that I've ever seen the movie Volcano. I saw... What's the one with Tom Hanks? Joe versus the volcano? I saw that. So. Waterfall. Waterfall. I wonder how we'll get up there. We'll just head up that way and see. Maybe we can take a hint from the phone guy if we need to, and we'll see what happens. 
The book was really good. It was like a story within a story within a story. That's how the movie is. In the movie, the kid's getting bullied, and so he goes up to read in, like, the attic of the school or whatever. And... He finds the never-ending story, and he, like, as he's reading it, he realizes, that it's like, that he has a part in it and stuff like that. Hoot. The shape of the key shows a fish swimming up a cascade of water. Go now to the mountain waterfall. A leap from the top and you will reach your goal. A leap from the top. Okay. Alright. Tom Hanks punches a volcano. Sounds very Resident Evil 5 of him. The floor is lava. Oh shit. <laughs> Sorry. There was a year where there were two volcano movies that came out and you always get them confused. I don't know. It's pretty much a huge earthquake in LA and a volcano pops up in the middle of the city and it has Tommy Lee Jones in it. That does not ring any bells for me. Ah! Ah! Eh! Ah. I just want to see what was down this way. I think this was a mistake. What's this? Oh, I thought maybe I could put it in the water. Ah, oh, why did I do that? <laughs> I knew where it was going. Secrets are like water when it comes to bridges. Secrets are like water when it comes to bridges. Under them? Water under the bridge? Does that mean I need to dig? I wonder if that's what I was looking for. It's in a subway? Wild. I've never been a big disaster movie person. Okay, let's skip back up. Oh god. I should take the portal from the animal town. Jeez! That is a <laughs> an animal. Okay, get me out of here. There were a lot of natural disaster movies in the 90s. I remember at Universal Studios going uh, to the Twister thing and it's scaring me. Because I lived in Kentucky at the time where there were tornadoes. <laughs> that was... Impeccable timing. Thank you for the raid, Jacob. Hi again. Hello. I didn't know that you streamed. I'll have to check you out. How was your stream tonight? What were you playing? I gotta set up the thing where it tells me what I was, what people were playing. Hello, hi everybody. <laughs> nice to meet you. Um, I have been in the middle of trying to figure out how to get up to this waterfall here in Link's Awakening. It's my first time playing it. Even I never played the original one either. Oh, you're playing Mario Maker Two. I am so bad at Mario Maker. But I love to watch it because I'm bad at it. So I like I appreciate when someone is good at it. It makes me happy. Let's see. If I can't go up. Oh man. Let's see if we can do anything from the seashell mansion. You just finished this game, you got stuck so many times. We got stuck a little bit earlier. But I was able to figure- oh, when I needed to go get Marin to bring her back to the animal village, I couldn't figure that out. So eventually I just went to try and figure out what she was up to in town and found she was missing, so. Oh man. Excellent. Well hey, if you guys came over from the raid, uh, I'm Kristen. I do a variety stream. So on Tuesdays and Thursdays, I just started Link's Awakening on Tuesday, so that's what we're playing. And then, ah! On Wednesdays, I've been playing Sega Genesis games, just like a random assortment of them. And then on Saturday, I'm playing Final Fantasy XII The Zodiac Age for the pseudo first time. I'd played it before, and I, <laughs> I knew that I had played it a long time. But for some reason, I can't remember anything about it. And so I looked at my save file and found out that I played 42 and a half hours of it. And I don't remember a single thing. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Lindor. Like the chocolates. 
All right, let's... I wish I could zoom in just slightly more. Because I feel like maybe I'm supposed to go up there. I can't really tell where I'm supposed to... I guess I should just make my way up to the top and we'll figure it out. <laughs> pretty much I did. I, pr I pretty much blacked out for 42 hours. I have no idea. For some reason, the only thing that I, I can recall is that at some point you go to the town full of the bunny people. That I know that you do that. And I remember some of the characters. But for the rest, complete blank. <laughs> And I have no idea why. So it's fun to replay it again. And I'm really liking the Gambit system on it. I don't remember Pinello the Potato, no. And Pinello's growing on me. I, I started off as a big Pinello hater. But I, I she's coming around. We'll have to see. I didn't explore a lot of these places after I got the long jump. You know you mentioned it before, but you've beaten Final Fantasy... Uh, 12, two to three times and you couldn't tell me the story of Final Fantasy 12. Yeah, the story is very, like, they do the thing that a lot of Fire Emblem games do where they, they just give you a lot of exposition in between cutscenes. And sometimes it's easy to get lost. You hate how you forget everything you invest your intention, intention into. It only gets worse as we get older, too, I feel like. I used to have a- my, I mean, my mind is still a little bit of a steel trap, but not anything like it used to be. I don't know if I've gone down there. Let's go down there. Whee! Linder chocolates are so good. You only remember Fran because she's in hottie, a hottie with an old accent. The accents in Final Fantasy XII are insane. Everybody's accent is everywhere. Oh, odd. I also was going to ask you what an old accent meant. I want to know what this is. This seems suspicious. And the airship you remember for some reason. I do remember being on the airship. Why did those things not stop coming? We're also saving up our rupees for... Man. <laughs> for a bow and arrow because it costs 980 rupees. And I refuse to steal. Because I want to keep friends with all these people. Okay, come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Nailed the jump. Oh, man. Whew. You've been playing Final Fantasy XIV and the mix of technology is so jarring but interesting. Final Fantasy games love to do that, I feel like. Final Fantasy X is my favorite, but they're pretty... They're pretty bad about it. The Forbidden Machina. And just the existence of, like, gun blades. <laughs> They're all over the place. Remember getting lost at some point and getting mad at it? That sounds like something that will happen to me in my playthrough. <laughs> that happens to you in just about every game we play. Airships and robots and then- or, and magic and then suddenly robots. Uh, have you played Chrono Trigger? Chrono Trigger is pretty, uh, wild about that as well. Let's have this lady give us another creepy massage. Oh, is this a waypoint? It feels like it's... Sh it is. Why is it glowing? Can I do something to it? No. That looks like it's glowing. I'm, I'm not crazy. <laughs> I'm not crazy. You're crazy. Hmm. Everyone is in a crop top in Final Fantasy XII. That is the the most wild thing, besides the accents, is that everyone's in a crop top. 28 rupees. That's cheaper than last time, isn't it? Fran does like bondage uh, gear, but not anywhere near as much as Lulu from Final Fantasy X. The Queen of Belts. <laughs> Vaughn is a hunk. Nobody believes that. I love the name Tall Tall Heights. What's this? This isn't that guy's hut, is it? Oh, it is. So if that's Dompe's shack, then what's this other building? 
Oh, that was a... Oh, God, I didn't mean to plant that bomb. Was this a dungeon? What about t Pain from 10-2? I guess she would be up there. Is this... Was this a dungeon? Oh, yeah, this is where we got the chomp... The, ch the, the chain chomp from. I can't remember what they called it. They didn't call it a chain chomp. They called it something nicer, and I feel mean every time I call it a chain chomp. I thought I switched this out. No. <laughs> I did not mean to do that. Here we go. That's what I wanted. Now we have a little portal. Now we're thinking with portals. She's giving you the regular customer discount. Oh no. I don't know if I want to be a regular at her shop. Or do I? Rub, rub, rub. That always makes me think of Pokemon on the St. Anne when you rub the captain's back. <laughs> you just have an extended scene of rub, rub, rub. Tompe Shack. Bring any weird stones you find. Okay. I think this is the way. Show you two video game characters with more kissable lips than who, Vaughn? Bow Wows. Thank you. Yes. I also have just always known them as chain jumps. Hoot. The windfish sleeps long and dreamily in the egg above. When you play the eight instruments of the sirens in front of the egg, he will awaken. This, my friend, is the only way for you to leave the island. Okay, so this seems like this is the... This is probably I'm supposed to go to it later, but... Mount Tamarank. I just kind of want to see what's up here. I guess it's... Oh, it's a big egg! I don't know what else I expected <laughs> to be up there. A big egg. Yes, yeah, Princess Peach. Actually, Princess Toadstool. Mario Jumpman. <laughs> this this little guy? Nah, it's Zelda. <laughs> Everyone loves that bit nowadays. It's played out. I, I used a played out joke, my friends. Okay, let's see. What do we have here? Oh god. That was stressful. Hmm. I think I made a mistake. Maybe? Yes. <laughs> Not played out. Classic. Perfect. Okay, let's see. Can I break this through here? No. Oh, God! No! I did not realize that the... the... Uh, the... the thing would be shooting fire at me. Tag you when you post them. Yeah, Stax mutes us on Discord. Stax doesn't want to hear about it. <laughs> Unless it's about wasps. Oh god. Oops, wrong button. Piece of power! This is interesting. Where am I supposed to... How am I supposed to do that? Can I jump? I can't- there's no way I can jump over it, right? Nope. What did you miss? Uh... Me falling off the platform three times. <laughs> um, I found where the egg is. What? Oh, that guy's stuck. Other than that, I'm trying to find a waterfall. Is this the waterfall? Nope, that's like a mini waterfall. I think I'm trying to find this waterfall. Or, not, or that waterfall. There's so many waterfalls. You don't have us muted? You have notifications turned off? Oh yeah, I don't have push notifications on on my Discord. I am in too many servers for that. Ba, ba, ba. Oh man. 
That's the second time I've gotten got by a, a slime being in the chest. That makes me sad. Let's see. Hey, you. Yep, Papa got lost, just like he said. Now I am so famished I can't move. Can you give me some vittles? Vittles? I'm just gonna say... I just said yes to see what it said. <laughs> I had no idea that that would work. That's like when I put uh, butthead in the, in the game last night when I had to put in a password. He should at least give you a gem when you killed him? Exactly. I should get some reward. Although, to be fair, that slime's probably been sleeping in that chest for years, and I just came in and really awoke it. This pineapple is so delicious. I'm gonna eat it right now. Bon appetit. Vittles. He means victuals? Ah, this wasn't meant to be a reward. Here, take this. It's a hibiscus. Okay, we know who needs the hibiscus. The hibiscus is an animal town. There's, uh, or an animal village. Uh, that, that girl who told us we didn't know how to talk to ladies. Delicious. Yum. I'm filled with energy now. Perfect. Okay, how do we get to... There. I want there. I don't know enough about pineapple to <laughs> understand what just happened there. Oh, I see. I can make the jump from the this side. I was overthinking that. We're rich. We're almost to that. I guess not almost. We're like 300 something away. But I want that bow and arrow. I think we can make this. Oh, <laughs> not even close. Maybe. Nope. Okay. We'll have to revisit this, I think. Because as it stands right now, I don't see a way to get over there. Om nom 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 nom. It's like this game heard me saying how I didn't care for pineapple, and it was like, yeah, but what if every character you run into loves pineapple? Okay, I think this is the one. It said something about jumping in from below or above. Well, I can't get over this way. Can I bla blast through it? Nope. Hmm. <laughs> did we go this way already? I think I did, but... Oh yeah, this is how I got to the pop-all. pop -all. We gotta get out of here. We gotta go. <laughs> Before the bats come. This here's bat country. Okay, there's a few ways, it looks like. We could be going. And every way that I have chosen is incorrect. I guess I'm going to backtrack. Because right now I don't see any other way to go. I've never actually read or watched Fear and Loathing. I must confess. I just know the reference. We went to... My friend and I went to a music festival in the fall. And he decided he wanted to do costumes or like cosplays for the days that we went. And one of the ones that he did, well, he did a Fear and Loathing one, one of the days. And people loved it. People loved his outfits. Bonk, bonk, bonk. It's very, very strange. I haven't seen that or Clockwork Orange. And I feel like they're both required viewing. But I don't... Sometimes I like dark I like dark tones, but I don't necessarily like disturbing visual visuals is my, usually the problem I run into with stuff like that. Let's go this way. Bonk. Oh no. The bonker became the bonky. You were a huge fan of Hunter S. Thompson and you read all his books. Now you think he was into some pretty bad stuff so you don't like him anymore. You dressed up, dressed up as him as an, at an event one time. I don't know why I couldn't say that sentence. That's cool. Didn't he do something crazy like have his remains shot out of a cannon or something like that? 
I know he did a lot of crazy stuff, but. Raul Duke. I like Raul Dahl. <laughs> Raul Duke, I don't know who that is. You don't really like Clockwork Orange anymore either? It's a very harsh scene where they assault a woman. That's, I, yeah, I've, I have heard of that. You don't like it at all? Yeah, it's very... It seems very controversial. But it also is like a... A movie that people always seem to... Oh, there's the thing to put in the key right there. Let's go activate this little stand thing and then we'll... Then we'll go in there. Tall, tall heights. It's hard to watch. The whole film leaves you feeling very uneasy. You can't do films like that or Requiem for a Dream. I've never watched Requiem for a Dream all the way through. I've only ever seen the ending. And <laughs> it's like one of those things where I kind of am like, uh, I don't know if I want to watch this all the way through. Okay, so now can we jump in? I think we can now go in from where I was trying to go, but the waterfall was blocking us. Let's go back. It looks like there's a lot more stuff to do right down there. I wonder if I should do it before we go. Let's do it before we go. I should have grabbed that ruby. You actually like the Requiem for a Dream and you like the soundtrack. I do like that song that... Da -da, da -da -da -da, da -da -da -da. My friends <laughs> in high school, we had this thing where we were very into, like, you uh, tell a story while that song played and try to freak each other out. Oh no! This seems like I should just throw a bomb down it. There we go. Oh, give me a seashell. Stax isn't even in the Discord. He is. He's under... Um, his name in there is Jackrock, and it's spelled with special characters. So sometimes it's hard to at him. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Did that bomb never go off? Doesn't seem like it did. Hmm. Okay, let's see what's down these ladders and then we'll go back to the waterfall. Yeah, the bomb didn't seem to go off. I don't know what happened. What is that? Is that Zero Suit Samus vodka? Why is she looking so sly? Uh oh. See, I definitely feel like I'm missing some sort of item. We'll have to do some backtracking. Or I'll figure out a mechanic of some sort. I think the other emote is her butt. Oh yes, it is. That other emote is definitely Zero Samus's butt. Zero Suit Samus, excuse me. It makes me, I, I mean, I know they say this all the time, but it makes me sad every time I see an emote of a butt, knowing that they declined my emote that simply said the word butt. Tragedy. I feel like throwing those big boulders at these things is like the most brutal way to kill them. Maybe they thought the entire phrase was offensive, not just the word butt. Maybe. Up your butt is not offensive. I take offense to you thinking it could be construed as offensive. Um, uh, oops. Oh, I know. I know you don't think- you're, you're not offended by such a wonderful phrase. <laughs> it's like Hakuna Matata. You know, Hakuna Matata. Uh, namaste, up your butt. <laughs> All in the same ballpark. Oh yeah, wrong. It's okay though, we still have it in the Discord. And also, if you have better Twitch TV, the BTTV plugin, I added it there. Somehow the my mom joke from regular show is lightening your mood. Uh-oh. I wasn't paying attention where we were going. 
I kind of know the my mom joke. One of my friends used to say it all the time. Level four, Angler's Tunnel. All right. What time is it? Should I start this? Yeah, I should start this. We'll probably do this and then this will be our last task for the evening. <laughs> exactly, yeah. A nice cross stitch that your grandma made that just says up your butt in fancy little rainbow letters. Is That seems drownable. <laughs> I love the drowning noise. It's so good. This is really nice, pleasant music. Complimented by the sounds of me taking a bunch of damage. Is that a key? Oh, the compass? That was a nice thing to get right off the bat. <laughs> can you buy that on Etsy? I'll have to learn to cross stitch and then I can make them and market them. You claim it was all my idea. <laughs> Now we got a key. I am not crafty, though. There are a lot of crafty people in this world. I don't know if Kato's still there. Kato's very crafty. Uh, Tozzle's probably in bed for sure by now. She's crafty. All these people, very crafty. Not me. You're 100% sure you can find it on Etsy? <laughs> that idea's free? I'll take it. I think we're gonna get something that will let us swim, you guys. <laughs> based on how this is. I feel like Kata will deny that they're crafty, but they are very crafty. Um. Oh, it's probably that chest that's up there. This might be a tough one for me, you guys. The drowning noise is just too enticing. <laughs> and we got the map. Excellent. It's much nicer when you have the map and the compass early on. <laughs> instead of finding the map very last. Oh, what am I doing? Yeah, and yeah, the drowning hardly does any health uh, damage, so... It's very tempting to just keep drowning yourself when you hear the cute little noise. You made a link out of perler beads and it came out super cool so you bought two giant tubs of them because you were like, I'm gonna make all the Final Fantasy IV characters <laughs> three years ago. I imagine they are still sitting it's from the sound of it. Let's see if we get anything for killing all these. Nothing. Unless this thing also needs to go. It's stuck. Ah! No! Okay, that didn't- nope. <laughs> nope, that was not the plan. They're 100% sitting there. I do that sometimes. You know what I got? I got really into lunch boxes for a while, like bento style lunch boxes, and I bought a bunch of them and I used maybe like one of them. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> Ooh, that's a double dog dare. That's uh are you going to are you going to do the double dog dare? You're going to take the physical challenge. <laughs> Whoops, did not mean to throw that into the water. Oh, we gotta... The th when he winds up at the run, it's so cute. It is among the cutest things. The physical challenge is also about perler beads. <laughs> oh, we got the beak early too? This is great. We're, we're, this is everything going better than expected so far. 12.30 a.m.? That's the perfect time to start an arts and crafts project. Work schmirk. What do you gotta do tomorrow? <laughs> 
tomorrow. Tomorrow, then, that's the attitude that got us to this bucket in the first place. Oh, God. <laughs> Straight into it. This water bug. There we go. I was going to say I wished water bugs looked like that in real life, but I feel like a water bug that looked like this in real life would probably be really terrifying. Tomorrow, tomorrow. You got an interview for a different company tomorrow? Nice. Are you excited? Are you feeling ready? I don't think I'm going to make that jump. You're an old man with a bad knee. You can clearly never do perler art again. Yeah, that's the spirit. <laughs> Alright, we're going to circle back to that. Maybe? Yeah, no. Nope. Can I do this at an angle? That, like, almost- I think- I feel like I almost cheesed that. You had to replace Ori's hut with a fully wooden one because her other one was unsafe. She's chewed it up so much she will literally eat herself out of house and home. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, no, no, no. I read- Oh, you're right. I was singing- I was busy singing, yeah, vodka typed the, the lyrics to tomorrow. So yes, I was singing tomorrow. And thought that you also said your thing was tomorrow. But next week. Next week. Oh god. Simple mistake. Oh my god. Desperately scouring your house for food to eat and all you can find are waffle cones. It sounds like a happy accident. Well, well wait, wait, wait. I guess I should clarify. Did you also find the ice cream to go into the waffle cones? Because that changes everything. You put snow in it. <laughs> that that would also work. Oh no. I'm scared to find what's going on on Discord between these two. Alright, we gotta find a... Where? So this is the... There's two places that I could go. That require... The key. And I'm not sure how to get to either of them. This definitely is not right. Last time you had ice cream was literally a pint of Ben and Jerry's and it killed your stomach. Dude, last time I had... Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. I need to come in from the bottom and go across. Um, last time I had Ben and Jerry's, it also really upset my stomach. Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese and a waffle cone does not sound like the worst idea. I'm not going to lie to you. Just freeze it. <laughs> Alright, good night, Jack. Sleep better, or sleep well. And I hope you have a good day. Thanks for hanging out. I see what we're doing now. We're well on our way. <laughs> what type of- what type of cottage cheese? I only like a- like- a very specific type, like, brand and size of cottage cheese. And by size, I mean, like, curd size. Okay, now I understand. This way. I understand, but can I execute? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Too, st too close. Way too close. There we go. That should not have been as difficult as it was for me. Grace asking if this combo is only for kissable humans on Discord. <laughs> Listen. We didn't talk about kissing dogs. Marriage does not have to be... Marriage does not have to be like that. Doesn't have to be like that. Come on, you. Oh, this was a terrible, terrible. Oh, maybe not that terrible. OK, 
Okay, we'll go down. We'll go down. I don't know if it's possible for me to dig the hole any deeper, Dusty. I don't think this was right. Unless, this, can I blow this up? Nope. I did not do that on purpose. I wish. Time to sleep? All right, good night, Daewoo. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, well, look, I solved my problems. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. I don't. I don't enjoy that. That just happened. <laughs> Master puzzle solver. Yep, that was my grand plan all along. Okay, let's talk to the owl here. We all respect you. There were no clips made. I will wait. We'll wait and see till I get <laughs> in Discord later. The glint of the tile will be your guide. The glint of the tile. Can I push this? Do you do something? Hmm. Like, I guess I'll just get hit. I didn't even talk shit. That's too long of a jump to make. Clipping takes too much time. That's what I like to hear. Oh man. Clip button's missing for you most of the time? Someone in Tozzle's Discord was saying that was hap- or Tozzle's chat was saying that was happening for them the other night. I've not had that happen, but it seems to disappear sometimes for people. No, you don't. No, you don't. The glint of the tile will be your guide. I wonder what that means still. Maybe that's this. Oh! Okay, so not that. I clearly need to step on these in like the right order. But I want to kill this thing first. Aww. I don't see a glint. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, maybe I go to the left. Just immediately to the left. No. The only other one left is that one way over there. I don't think I can make that. I'm gonna count that as a victory. <laughs> now which one? This one? Damn. <laughs> yeah, I am a elite hacker. I'm the hacker known as Anonymous. <laughs> I did it again. Um, nope, okay. So middle one after this. <laughs> I'm guessing it's probably this one next. Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. I wonder what the actual way I'm supposed to be doing this is, but this works, so I'm gonna keep doing it. Oh! <gasps> Maybe not. <laughs> Which does show me that I am hitting the edge in these cases, and I should be making those jumps, is what it means to me. <laughs> you want the drowning Oh my god! The drowning sound has a text tone. There we go. Get me out of here. This is probably where that key fell down to. I have a fairy in a bottle. The sub sound and animation. I like my sub sound. It's very uh, fun and exciting. Oh god. Uh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> and oh that's true and we have our special massage good call 
at a heavy discount. <laughs> oh, we got the nightmare key. Side scroll link drowning was very graphic. <laughs> it was. Animated violence. In fact, it was. Did I just go the wrong way? I think I did. I don't think I wanted to do this. Well, now we know where the, the key, the nightmare key leads us. Or where we need to use it. I need to come in from underground. Straight from the underground. Let's go to the right. To the right, to the right. Everything you need in a room to the right. Um. Oh my god. Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? I know I can throw bombs over those. Can I jump them? No. Hmm. Let's go back this way. I don't really know... Which way to go? What? Think. Let's see. We have a two locked paths. I'm not quite sure how to get to this one. It seems like we got near it once. Maybe I have to... I don't know. We'll tr let's just see if we can figure it out. Oops, wrong way. We'll start back at the beginning. Oh man, I thought I could like do a sweet- That- okay, that one? Garbage. Garbage, I say. Oh man. Should I use my fairy? Nope. We're hoarding. Hoarding J. Levitt. What does this guy say? The glint of the tile will be your guide. Yes, we've already read that. So there's a chest over there that I can't figure out how to get to right now. You didn't like Horton J. Levitt? <laughs> no respect and no regard. Let's see this first. Boom. <laughs> no esteem. None of the above. Okay. What are you? Oh my god. No? Not bombs? Maybe I do this and then come around and sneak attack you? Oh! Oh god. I feel like that was an accident as well. I need to get behind it somehow. Or maybe... I'm gonna take this victory. I think I'm doing it in like a way weird way, but if it works, as we've established, if it's dumb but it works, it's not dumb. Oops. Damn it. I think he only needs one more hit. Come in. Nope. I don't really know how to Oh, can I just jump? Oh, duh! Maybe? No. I don't really know what you want. Oh, God! I'm gonna run out of bombs. Because I'm doing this in a stupid, stupid way. What else do I have? Um, I don't really know. 
my original thought here was that I could stop it with a bomb and then try and make my way behind it. Oh god. My my dumb way stopped working. Let's use the fairy. That didn't even heal me all the way. What kind of fairy are you? Let's see if this does anything. Oh. Was that all I needed to do the whole time? What's happening to me? I don't even know if the... What is happening? I don't really quite understand how I'm making my way through this. I think I'm just kind of brute forcing at this point. Maybe I did need that because it seems... What the... If you ask me what I'm doing here, no answer for you. I have no idea what I just did, but it worked. And we beat the boss. Well, the mini boss. Come here. Oh, I should have captured it. Duh. <laughs> yes, GG. Yeah, there's lots of happy little accidents happening in this dungeon tonight. <gasps> Butthead. Oof, I shouldn't have made that. TLCs, I shouldn't be alive, or whatever network that's on. National Geographic? It's on something that it shouldn't be on. <gasps> we got the flippers. Dive underwater with B or press A to swim quickly. Quickly. <laughs> quickly. Hold on one second. I knew that was going to be a big sneeze. History Channel? This one's easy because it tells us. Maybe it, I was supposed to do this one first and then that's the same pattern from the one downstairs. Are these just little dogs wearing masks? This feels mean. We can swim now. Look at us go. You were wrong, Discovery Channel? Ah, fair enough. Life's rough. When you're a dog in a dungeon. Oh, I want that heart. Oh, no more drowning noise. That's the downside here. Rupees. Pretty soon, we're gonna be at the... We're gonna be at that bow and arrow. Whee! Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh, I don't have a key. Um, where did I miss? Oh, okay. It's gotta be there. No more drowning. Now my sword is stream. Oh man, I was reading chat. God, get me out of here. Doing a little like somersault attack is so fun. You definitely feel like the coolest human. Look at me go. Um, how do I get back down there? It's probably easiest to just teleport back. Figure it out after. <laughs> Listen, that is a quote taken much out of context, Stax. We love Stax here. Everybody loves Stax. No, everyone loves Stax. Everyone hates wasps. Everyone hates wasps. I can't even say it. Everyone hates wasps. I swear normally I can talk, you guys. I am up... Oh my god, I didn't realize how late it was. We are on later than our normal ending time. But we're so close to the end of this dungeon, I can feel it. Sorry, East Coasters. Here we are. Oh, 
Oh, that's a fairy. Let's see if we can catch it. Fairy, come over here. Come here. Whew, that was close. <laughs> Fairy. It's a lot of I's and E's. Unfairy. Oh, man. Oh, man. Pun patrol. Pun patrol. I like it. You tried changing your clocks to West Coast time, but the other people in your life didn't approve. There's only one solution, is to move to the West Coast. Then they have no choice. But to succumb. Come on. There we go. You have to sleep. Have a good night. Alright, you have a good night. Thank you for hanging out, and thanks again for the follow. I am also pretty sleepy. Thank you for the, the the well wishes as well. I hope we... I feel like we're close to the end. I think we should be able to knock it out. Whee! Oh, wrong way. Looking forward to watching some Sega Genesis. Yes, on Wednesday, the next Wednesday, we're going to be playing Taz Escape from Mars. And then I was kind of de debating maybe swapping out to a different console after that Wednesday, but then someone showed me a game and I bought it today. <laughs> so I think I have something in, in line for the week after that as well. Did I not get a key? What did I get out of that chest? Just the fairy? Where am I missing a key? Oh my god, you're right. It was just a purple rupee. Can I not see the basement level? Maybe if I zoom it. Oh no. I didn't... Yeah, I did not go into the basement yet. I don't... Let's try that. Because, yeah, that one did fall down there. Good call. That noise is so pleasant. I'm guessing. Oh, yeah, we can swim now. Yeah, we did this before we could swim. Oh, my God. There we go. That spiny did drown. Maybe it deserved it. Oof. Oh. There we are. Dude, so cute. Look at it. Oh. Whoops. So, every time you reach for a cough drop or you think she's getting a treat. Uh, Tuner, I hate to nag you, but have you gone to the doctor yet? Is your cough getting better? Oh no! Slime party. Alright, this is it. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. The final showdown. No, and you think you figured out how you got coronavirus? You popped some bubble wrap and the air inside was from China? <laughs> That's a, it's a solid theory, Tuner. I like it. <laughs> oh, man. But if you can, if you can go to the doctor, you should. I always put off going to the doctor, and then every time I end up actually doing it, I'm like, oh, why didn't I do this weeks earlier? Because I'm always cured in like a few days <laughs> by the medicine. Modern medicine. But I understand everybody's insurances are different and healthcare providers in the area, etc, etc. You just remembered you ordered something from Wish? I can't say that I've ever ordered anything from Wish. Alright, let's head down onto the basement. You feel like it's a cough and a runny nose now, though? You think the doctor would think you're a dumbass? No. 
I think the doctors deal with that kind of stuff all day. And that is their job. Yeah, USA. <laughs> yes, Jacob. Bloop, bloop, glub, glub. Arg, food, bloop, glub. Anglerfish, uh oh. Anglerfish are like why I'm afraid of the water in real life. Well, I'm not afraid of the water. I'm afraid of the deep ocean, I should say. Like, what, like that's why I won't play Subnautica. <laughs> the deep ocean is a scary thing. Because if you would have told someone that an anglerfish existed, they would have been like, like if you just drew it, it was like, oh, look what this little kid made up. And then to find out that they're real, insane. More anglerfish? Try to call a homie? Yeah, things in water. Exactly. That's more of what I... Wait, wooden boats? And why are there teeth see you through? Exactly, Lindor. We did it. <laughs> that fish ain't right. You ordered it back in January before it was serious. <laughs> I ordered some stuff during Awesome Games Done Quick that I haven't gotten yet. It was supposed to ship in January. There we go. That was kind of an easy fight. Order something good, Stags. You see Wish has a lot of Harry Potter stuff, which is cool, but probably not cool when it actually arrives. We got a harp. Oh, good dungeon. I thought you were saying, God damn. I was like, I don't know what I did. <laughs> we got the Serp harp. sub mechanophobia. Huh. <laughs> Thanks, I hate it. Alright, so I think that puts us at four... Bay. We know where the bay is. We already have a thing active down there. We can. We have so much more exploding... Exploding? <laughs> we have so much exploding to do. We have so much more exploring to do now that we have the, fi the flippers. That helps us a lot. Alright, but for now, I'm going to go ahead and save... It is past uh, normal stream end time. And it is... We're encroaching on my bedtime. Encroaching. All right. Let's see. You ordered your nephew a baby Yoda plushie from China and he just got it yesterday. It looks like crap. <laughs> One time I got my friend... This is kind of mean, but we both didn't like the movie Ponyo. And we would send each other the... We would kind of rickroll each other with the song from the end of Ponyo. The Ponyo, Ponyo, fishy, fishy in the sea. Because um, look, now that I sang that, it's going to be stuck in your head all day if you know it. Um, so I found on Etsy this person who was selling the worst Ponyo plush that I'd ever seen in my whole life. And I got him it for Christmas. And it came and I could not have been more thrilled because it looked even worse in person. <laughs> It's so bad. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Let's see who's on. If anybody's on that we can raid. Oh, man. Thank you guys for hanging out. This was a fun stream. And thank you again uh, to Jkiv for the uh, for the raid. Oops. That's not a command. That's a command. Um, who is on? Dun, 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 dun. Um... Let's see. There's a, quite a few people on, actually. I'm surprised. It's a Thursday night. What's everyone doing? What's everyone doing up so late? Um, what are you guys thinking? Mrs. Ginge is on playing Death Stranding, or Canadian Papa Bear is playing Contradiction Spot the Lie again? I think that Contradiction game is really cool. And I very rarely get to catch can, uh, Canadian Papa Bear on as well. I say let's go say hi to Canadian Papa Bear. So I'll see you guys Saturday for Final Fantasy Twelve. Oh God, for Final Fantasy Twelve. Uh, same same general time, probably around six p.m. Pacific time for Saturday stream, and then we'll go till we get too sleepy to play anymore. So, <laughs> uh, probably so I should hopefully be able to catch you guys. So again, thank you guys for hanging out for the raids, for the follows, for the bits, for the chatting, most of all. And I will see you then. Let's go say hi to Papa Bear.
Good night.